All right. Happy Cozy Monday, everybody. Let's swap this over. How are we doing? How are we all doing today? Y'all ready for some chaos? I don't know why everyone keeps tweeting chaos at me, but I have a feeling that there's uh, either this game is chaotic or there's some giant Final Fantasy monster called chaos. That's what I've gathered from popular responses to me announcing that I'm going to play Final Fantasy 1 for the first time. How ready are you? How ready am I? Oh, we're, oh, we're already asking. We're already asking the streamer what he thinks. Okay, fine. Uh, I'm I'm very ready. I am so ready because I have uh, I have done something I don't usually do, which is set this camera uh, to auto everything because I'm I have my lights as like dim as they will go. I'm gonna flip this switch on my chair and I'm gonna lean back. Mm. I got. Katie's Chicago Bears blanket, which is really comfy. And we're just going to get cozy. We're going to get cozy and it's going to be, it's going to be wonderful. Oh yeah. Oh, oh, is my hair? Oh, thank you. Thank you, Robin. Thank you. I, uh, I spent the day in salt water yesterday. So I washed it right before bed and I was worried how it was going to come out. So I'm glad that uh, you're happy with how it looks. Glad you're happy with where, how it looks. Oh, yeah, we're getting cozy today. Um, if you've if you've missed if you've missed the tweets and you don't know what's going on here, or you're wondering where Kyle is, I saw that go by. Let me set this stream in a moment in time so that it may live forever into the future. And so people coming by the vod are like, "Hey, what 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 the f is happening?" Um, Kyle is uh, still away. Um, he is uh, entering uh, the second and final week of his paternity break. He has welcomed his third child into the world, uh, and so uh, we're I'm 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 covering for my buddy. He's he's taking some time being with his family, being a new uh, a, a triple times dad. So yeah, it's it's good. Garrett, wake up, Kyle's and oh my god, oh no, oh uh, did I, oh am I fight clubbing myself? Oh my God! Is Kyle, is Kyle my Tyler Durden? Is that what's going on? Oh my God! I hadn't thought about that. I hadn't considered that as an option. I think Kyle is my is my Tyler Durden. At least my Tyler Durden's like super wholesome, uh, and and a rad dad, instead of uh, kind of you know toxic. <laughs> Kyle is actually Frey. <laughs> Kyle, Kyle's too, Kyle's way too wholesome. Kyle's way too wholesome to be uh, a dark knight. Yeah, I know. Kyle's, Kyle's too wholesome. Way too wholesome. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. No, no, the, the Fergusons are doing great. Uh, baby is, uh, super healthy. Uh, I think, uh, last I heard, you know, sleep is somewhat interrupted. Um, but you know, it's to be, uh, it's to be expected with this, with this kind of, uh, this kind of scenario. So yeah, yeah. For White Mage Gaming, yeah. Uh, so y you'll notice I do have a save. That's why load isn't grayed out, and that was because I needed to figure out where the hell to put the camera. Um, I've settled on the top right because there's important shit down below, like in all corners. Um, if uh, if you're unfamiliar, uh, this is the Pixel Remaster version of Final Fantasy One, so it is uh, it is set up for widescreen gaming. Am I uh, top? Uh, yes. Yeah, sorry, top left. My brain. I'm pointing out, you get the idea, you get the idea, but there's a map, uh, on over in the other corner and then the menus in battle, uh, there's a lot of shit going on down below. So I, 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 I did technically start this game. I loaded it up, walked away. I made a bullshit party just to get in and see a random encounter so I could find out where to put the camera. That's the, that is all I've done so far. So, um, yeah, yeah. So, uh, the preamble is I have, I've never played Final Fantasy one, um, uh, if you, uh, if you're familiar with these parts, obviously we, we stream a lot of Final Fantasy 14. Um, I'm quite, uh, I'm quite aware of Final Fantasy 14 now. Other than that, the only Final Fantasy I've played is Final Fantasy 10, uh, and 10 2. I have not beaten either of those games. Uh, some of you will probably fire up with, uh, well, why'd you play 10 2 if you didn't beat 10? Uh, because this is really why. I don't know. I was a teenager and I didn't care. It looked cool, so I wanted to play it. So I did, but I never beat it. Um, so, 
Uh, if you consider hitting the first set of credits in Endwalker beating a Final Fantasy, the only Final Fantasy I've ever beaten is 14. Um, and uh, uh, the goal this week is to beat Final Fantasy 1. Um, normally, uh, inter- if you're not familiar with the Grinding Gear programming schedule, we usually podcast on Mondays, but uh, Kyle's out. I had Marco as a guest last week. We're just taking a week off from the podcast, and I'm adding an extra stream day to it. So we're going to stream Final Fantasy 1 today. We're going to stream Final Fantasy 1 tomorrow, and the plan is to hopefully get far enough uh, along that uh, Thursday night's stream will be me beating Final Fantasy 1. Um, there's a flex day in there if I need to stream on Wednesday because I have farted around too much with all of y'all and I need to add an extra day. We can also add a Wednesday stream in there so that we can get enough done in Final Fantasy 1 that I can beat it. But everyone I've talked to, uh, including our illustrious MS Curator, our good buddy John, I, I bugged him because John's beaten, I think, every Final Fantasy. Um, I asked him, I was like, do you think I could do it in three days? And he's like, yeah, I'm pretty sure you could, you could beat it in three days. Uh, uh, it sounds like... It sounds like, um, where's my brain? My brain. Someone's, uh, yeah. Uh, it's, it sounds like there's a lot of ways to modify this. So you can do like experience modifiers, multipliers, um, auto battling, all that kind of stuff. Uh, we'll probably go in not using any of it, kind of see how it feels and then go from there. Uh, I have a feeling I'll probably end up using some sort of multiplier to kind of get through in a, at, at a decent pace, but I figured we'll see what happens. Brain is on Kyle's desk? Yeah, probably. That's probably where I left it. That's probably where I left my brain. Uh, John D. Arthur, thanks for kicking us off with a super chat um, at 5 o'clock yesterday, I guess. Um, said, choosing to believe I willed this into existence with comments a few streams back. Reality be damned, you got this. Uh, a, a, a few folks recommended it. I, I think I remember seeing your your recommendation or at least suggestion for Final Fantasy 1, John. Um, but yeah, the thought, the thought had occurred to me. And... Uh, when, when Kyle, uh, uh, a few weeks ago, Kyle and I had a meeting and kind of talked about what to do while he was gone. And he was like, dude, if, if you get in the mood for a single player game, he's like, just rip it. He even said Final Fantasy VII. I told him, just just so you know, I'm not going to rip VII without you. Um, but um, he did give me, he's like, go, just have fun. Like if something, if you're passionate, if you really want to like get into something, just go for it. Don't worry about me. Uh, so that absolute champion gave me, uh, gave me his blessing to get up to some single player nonsense while he was gone so here we are uh i've got i've got my blanket i've got my chair in a reclined position i've got uh the most over like overly serious controller this is my xbox elite controller that uh, my lovely wife katie gifted me i'm going to be using this to play this extremely demanding high apm video game and uh and yeah yeah Hmm. oh why are you informing me i'm streaming (laughs) Uh, don't you cheat on Kyle with those dang multiplayer games. <laughs> You're with KLG. What did KLG say? Why, what's what KLG got to? I'm trying to use my crappy wireless keyboard. Uh, do, oh, Don Trail Benchmark. Yeah, I heard about that. I I, I will be I'll be talking to Kyle. I'm trying not to bother him with, with, with stream stuff. Um, but I am curious how he wants to handle that. So when I, I'm going to be talking to Kyle later this week, so I'm going to be asking him, like, hey, man, do you just want me to rip it or you want to do this together or what? Um, so uh, we're, we're holding on the benchmark. I want to see I want to see what Kyle, if Kyle has an idea on how to do that or if we should just plan two separate streams. Two separate streams would be easier because we don't really have an easy way to show both of our gameplay and flip-flap back and forth between them um, live. So... That's my only thought there, but we'll see. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna plan that live. I'm not gonna plan that live. That is not the, uh, that is not the goal. That is not the goal. No, it isn't. No, it isn't. Uh, Dragon, thanks for re-upping your membership. Our Wojo is wishing everyone a happy Final Fantasy One Day and remembering everyone that you can like the stream and we appreciate it when you do. Drasoini, uh, sounds like I'm sending you down a memory lane. Here said, enjoy the game that started my love for RPGs, both video game and tabletop. Well, this and Dragon Quest, but still, hey, it all counts for Sony. Sideswiper, good to see ya. Uh, enjoy this when you get around to it. Uh, Thomas, 15 months, appreciate it. Said, resident lurker and professional VOD watcher here just to say, enjoy and have fun. I shall. I shall. I'm already um, enjoying the soundtrack, which I understand is um, redone. I did. I did go traipsing through the options and I, I guess I can set it to the original 8-bit but 
I, I tried it, and, and I like how this sounds. So I think I'm going to stick with the, the altered, updated soundtrack. That's what I think I'm going to go with that. Uh, yes, this is the Pixel Remaster. Uh, we got Chaos from Viden. Thank you for the Chaos. I appreciate your Chaos, Viden. Uh, Suna, thanks for the uh, the super. Saying, watching uh, Garrett and Kyle since Into the Nexus, and now Garrett is streaming Final Fantasy 1 on YouTube. Imagine telling my past self this would happen. They would just laugh and think of it as a bad joke. Here, here we find ourselves. <laughs> here we find ourselves. Nice to see Elidibus in the logo. Yeah, I know. He's looking He's looking healthy. He's looking healthy. I did... I don't know if anyone... If you've never picked up the Pixel Remasters, um, I did I, I did kind of go... I, I, I kind of tabbed through this. This art is fantastic. It is absolutely wonderful. I'm a little I'm a little hit and miss on Amano. I think some of Amano's work is, like, really great. And uh, some of it also, like, doesn't really hit for me. It's a little, uh, like, like to me, under underdeveloped. But, like... This shit is incredible. Um, like, I, I've seen this. I never knew what it was from. Um, like, look at that. That's absolutely great. Like, this, this is, like, some of my absolute favorite Amano work that I have ever seen. And it's, like, it's all very, like, to me, it's very visually consistent. Um, I think some of his stuff is, like, a little, like, a little loose. Uh, I like it when he takes his stuff to kind of this, this level of completion. Like, look at that. Look at that line work. It's, it's, it's goddamn incredible. Like, ah, I love this shit. I love this. The sketchy shit with, with, uh, what can, what can I can only assume was, was brushed on. That almost looks like watercolor, but who knows? Could be colored ink. So I, for me, it's always hard to tell if it's actually watercolor ink, but, but yeah, this shit, like, I love it. I absolutely love it. Like, look at that. Oh, oh, it's so good. Also, this stuff's great. This stuff's freaking fantastic. So anyway, uh, yeah, I was going through that stuff. Um, looks fantastic. I'm excited to see just like going through the gallery, like seeing so many references to Final Fantasy XIV that uh, I don't I don't understand. You know, um, obviously Warriors of Light getting name dropped uh, quite a bit, so that's rad. Uh, see, Garrett, everyone wants you to play every Final Fantasy. <laughs> I'll I'll get there eventually, Marco. You know, uh, this is not a commitment that it's going to happen in order. I'll um, after this, I'll probably jump to seven once I can get Kyle to agree to a time to do that. Uh, Seth and all, thanks for the 22 months. All White Mage Party is the minimum eye level run of FF1. <laughs> uh, yeah, I hear I have to. I have some choices to make. I mean, I'm already kind of aware of it because I, I started up a save just to see where to put my camera. So yeah, it does. Uh, apparently, I guess I, I need. I need to make a party, and 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 I hear I can't. I can't change. I can't go back on my decision with whatever party I decide to start with. So that's going to be interesting. Uh, I, I'm feeling uh, I'm feeling locked in. I'm feeling locked in. Uh, Malmuki, thank you for uh, one year being a, a member here on YouTube. Really appreciate it. Baki, thanks for the super. Uh, can't wait to see you finally play Final Fantasy 1, the game that is uh, pretty much Dungeons & Dragons. That's what I've heard. That's what I've heard, that it's like uh, really like pretty strongly based off old school D&D. Um, which I think is rad. I, I never played old D and D, but um, I think it was. I was. I listened. I still listen to a couple gaming podcasts on the regular, um, and probably my favorite one uh, is is the old Giant Bomb Crew over on Nextlander. That's probably my favorite gaming podcast. And I think it was last week's episode. Um, uh, Brad, who also might be one of my favorite podcasters. Ever. Uh, Brad was talking about how he was backing up his OG NES saves. And so I believe, I think this was the conversation. FF1 got brought up because I think he was backing up his FF1 save. And uh, they all started talking about how they all couldn't stand that in Final Fantasy 1, if you assigned one of your party members to attack and that target died before that party member attacked in their order, because I guess there's like an initiative role in this game, that they would just swing at an empty area because the, the, the target was now dead and just waste their attack on nothing. And um, I hear that that was fixed in the Pixel Remaster, and I'm very glad to hear that because that sounds awful. That sounds absolutely awful. Um, so, I'm, yeah, I'm really, I'm really happy to hear that that is one of the many improvements... Um, may, maybe you don't think it's improvement, so I'll say one of the many modifications in uh, in Final Fantasy One 
Pixel Remaster. I was, I was happy to hear that. Also, I just thought it was funny timing because I, I had pretty much already decided this is what I was going to do last week. I just did a very bad job uh, promoting it. Um, because I, I was, I'm used to having Kyle's help. I'll be honest. Like I'm, I'm used to having Kyle's help. I, uh, I lean on Kyle quite a bit and I hope he, that he feels like he leans on me. So yeah, I was, you know, doing all the scheduling myself, doing all the thumbnailing myself, obviously doing all the streaming alone, uh, except thank God Katie for joining me on Thursday stream. Um, so yeah, I, I meant to promote this last week and, uh, just never really got around to it. So I'm happy to, I'm happy to see so many of you are aware of it and are here. Thank you for joining me. Um, you know, it's something a little different today, so you never know how it's going to go. And I'm, I'm really pleased to see so many of you here. Thanks for joining me. Um, Kendrick. Kendrick said, this game is such nostalgia. I remember getting the Nintendo Power Guide in elementary school and trying to run my friends through it like a tabletop RPG. I hope you have a fun time of it. Chaos! Oh, shit. That's that's rad, Kendrick. Not not where I would have taken it, but I guess, you know, if you had a brain for that D&D style. I can totally see why that would be how you would take it. Oh, I'm gonna, oh God. Okay, I'm just gonna, oh. Are you gonna use OG soundtrack or remake? I think my plan, my, my gut feeling is remake because I, I already screwed around with the options. And um, where is it, BGM style? Like this is, listen, this, this, this is, this is definitely sending me. I had an NES. I didn't have Final Fantasy One. Um, like this is sending me right in the nostalgia for this this era of music. But I gotta say, I think I prefer. I think I prefer this. I think I prefer this. It 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 goes like this. Listen, look, I'm 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 in a reclined position under a blanket. Like this is cozy. This makes me happy. So I think I'm gonna go with this. Maybe every once in a while, if a track kind of hits, especially if I recognize a motif from Final Fantasy XIV, well, you know, we can pause, we can go in, and we can flip it and take a look or take a listen at what the eight bit was. I'm happy to explore and kind of take my time here. Like I said, I, I I'm not opposed to adding a Wednesday stream on if we go a little slower. Um, so. But right now, I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna lead with my gut on this one. I do want your input. I do want everyone's input on my party though, because I don't I don't want it to be overly hard, even though I know I can make it easier. But uh, let's see here, Dean online. Thanks for the 12 months. Said I look forward to the discussion video next week fe featuring Garrett talking to Garrett about his experience playing Final Fantasy One. <laughs> I hadn't really thought about that. I was wondering if I, uh, you know. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to poke Kyle and be like, hey, man, I'm assigning you homework. You need to beat Final Fantasy 1 so we can make a video about Final Fantasy 1. Um, no promises there. I do not want to stress. I do, I do not want to put that man under any pressure whatsoever. I hope he is as relaxed as someone who has probably even less sleep than he's used to having can can possibly can possibly have. Uh, Stevie Blunder, thanks for the super. Florida Man plays one of the OG weeb games. Let's go. Uh, apparently, I guess. Let's do it. Let's freaking go. Nicholas Carbonell, thank you for the 10 gifted memberships right now in chat. I appreciate it. Yeah, I was, um, I couldn't read when I had an NES. I got an NES before I learned how to read. Um, shout out to my, uh, my grandparents. Um, <laughs> Grampy Art and Grammy Jean is what we would call them on my dad's side of the family. That was my dad's parents. Um, they got me my first NES. Uh, and my grandfather was, he was the techie in the family. Um, no one else in my family was really tech savvy, but my, my grandfather, was, he was the first one in the family to have a computer. He was the first one in the family to have a console. He had his own uh, Nintendo Entertainment System. Um, and they, yeah, they got me my first NES before I actually could read. And I remember what was cool about being babysat by my grandparents is they had their own Nintendo. So I would, I would show up with my games and I could play NES games while, while they babysat me. Um, but he, my grandfather, he also had his own game collection, and and one of the games that he had was was Zelda. And I remember trying Zelda on the NES, and I didn't touch a Zelda game for years after that because I was frustrated. I was a kid, I couldn't read, and there was a lot of you know text boxes in Zelda. So I imagine my experience had I tried Final Fantasy One when I when the NES was current for me it would have been very much the same it would have been like why is there so much reading this game sucks <laughs> I was a I was a Mario uh, I really liked Mario I really liked uh, DuckTales even though it was hard as shit um, never beat DuckTales 
Um, and uh, I was a big Duck Hunt kid, you know. All the classic stuff. I had the, the split cart for, for Mario Duck Hunt that came with mine. Um, and uh, the, I remember the, Super, the Ninja Turtles game for NES being hard as shit, too. But, yeah. Um, let's see here. Etherwind. Thanks for the super. First game I ever owned, my original copy was taken and burned by my parents' church, but its demonic powers have only made it grow in strength. Have fun. Oh my god, Etherwind. Jesus. Um, well, hey, listen, I'm going to spin this positively and say, you got a hell of a story you can tell. That's a hell of a story. <laughs> Oh my god. The only thing I ever had like that, I remember my aunt throwing a, a VHS copy of Detroit Rock City um, out into the middle of the street watching a car run over it. Uh, I was watching that with my cousins uh, uh, over at their place one day, and she came in, and uh, I don't know, there was some cussing or something, and she took it out of the VCR and threw it in the street. She was not having it. Not having that shit in her house. Uh, the mirror! Said to the OG, hope you enjoy. Uh, yeah, I'm going to have a good time. I'm, ex- I'm excited to get a tour of uh, many of your childhoods, apparently. That's what I'm picking up. Biden, thanks for the super. Said, just want to say I'm thankful for all the fun GG provide. This Monday is a stressful one because a managing director is forcing us to launch a website early. This saves my day, eases the stress. Thank you. Uh, happy to help, Biden. Uh, sounds like many uh, a client experience I've had in my time. Um, I've, I've definitely been there. Uh, it's never it's never fun to release something before you think it's ready. It's not a good time. It's not a good time. Um, yeah, I've been asked about the Don Trail benchmark a bunch of times. Um, I'm I'm gonna wait and see what Kyle wants to do. Is is my is my feeling on the benchmark? I don't I don't want to rip that without at least asking him first, and I don't want to bug him until he uh, wants to be bugged. And uh, we have a day later this week where Kyle was like, "Hey, I want to talk," so I'm gonna wait until that until that day. I'm gonna wait until that day. Uh, Xavius. Uh, thinking I'm going to have a blast. I bet I'm going to have a good time. I bet I'm going to have a good time. Uh, Valeya, thanks for the super. Uh, and hey, it's all good. Enjoy this when you get to it. I'm glad you got to steal your brother's NES to play this back in the day. Uh, I will enjoy it, Micah. Thanks for the well wishes. Uh, Sir Louis says, Having only seen the Stranger of Paradise take on FF1, I'm excited to see how much more or less Limp Biscuit appears with it. Wait, what? Is Limp Biscuit in Strangers of Paradise? I, I've, I've only heard Strangers of Paradise like vaguely mentioned a few times because I, I think there's a co-op mechanic. I think... The limp... Wait, it is? Is it like actually Limp Biscuit or are they just like characters that people associate with Limp Biscuit? It's a very Linkin Park style song. Okay, well, I mean... Listen, one of those bands has stood the, st- the test of time and the other is Limp Biscuit. Um, but they're, you know cut from a similar starting point at least at least Jack Final Fantasy yells bullshit and then plays Limp Bizkit on his iPod shit I need to play uh, Strangers of Paradise that sounds awesome that sounds like a good time uh, I will enjoy it vernacular ham thanks for hanging for so damn long uh, KLG wishing me that uh, that I have fun said played way back in 88 on the NES it's uh Kindled my love for RPGs like Ultima 3 and Eye of the Beholder that uh, continues to this day. Go kill that chaos. Not me. I'll do my best, KLJ. I'll try not to kill you. I'll try not to uh, misfire here. Try not to misfire on you. Ethra, thanks for the super. Said, this is the kick in the ass I need to finish my own Final fantasy athon, clearing every main entry uh, at least once. Uh, best of luck with that, Ether. Ethra. Have fun with that. Uh, Zamara said, update on my mentor roulette journey. I'm 1,263 out of 2,000. If I do about 12 a day, I should finish before Dawn Trail. Good luck on Final Fantasy 1. Best of luck with that, Zamara. That is quite the quite the journey you're on. Quite the journey. Uh, Leah, super, lots of parties are viable. Fighter, thief, black mage, white mage is about as balanced as you can get. Interesting. And then Eric, oh shit. Thanks for the 20 gifted memberships. That's a lot. Appreciate it. Very generous of you. Um, excuse me, I need to clear my throat, and I don't have Kyle to cover for me, so I'm just going to announce it and do this. Ugh. Ugh, my uh, allergy meds have not kicked in yet, and uh, I spent all weekend outside, so my head is a little, um, 
a little foggy today. <laughs> it's 2,000 comms from Enter. That's my understanding, yeah. That's my understanding. The original FF cartridge came with a huge map and instruction manual. It seemed like such a value. I, I, I went Googling. Um, you know, I just was looking up things like, can you change your party after and inane questions like that? And uh, it's amazing how much Googling this game, you will find random comments around the internet and also the chatter in our Discord uh, mentioning the damn manual. Apparently the manual for Final Fantasy 1 is like a massive nostalgia touch point for a lot of people. So, um, yeah, man, I miss, I miss the days of rad ass game manuals. I really do. Um, my favorite manual was probably uh, the OG Pokemon manual. I remember going through that and looking at... I love the original, like, spot illustrations. I think they were ink and watercolor. The original spot illustrations for the uh, original 150 Pokemon. And there's a ton of them, obviously, in the uh, in the manual for that. So, yeah, that shit, that shit was my jam. Um, all right, let's... Uh, Let's, let's get into it, shall we? Because we're gonna we're gonna have to have a talk. We're gonna have to have a talk about what the hell I'm doing. Um, obviously, first in line is gonna be named Tuna. I mean, there's only one. Why aren't you letting me type? What is going on with this? Ugh, hold up. It's angry. There we go. So first slot is gonna be Tuna. Uh, second slot is definitely gonna be Val. I mean, there's, there's only there's only one way this can go. But then, what do we name? What do we name these these two? What do we name the other two? <laughs> Garrett and Kyle. <laughs> uh, we could also go with. Um, oh, you know what? Let, you know, we could we could do this. We could just. Uh, you know this this we could, we could just like go. We could go with first, first thoughts. This is what we could do. This is what we could do. We could, we just go with the first thing to pop into my head. Jesse and Joe Cat. <laughs> That's right. They did. Um, they did help me close out Endwalker. So, you know, I think we could. Um, I think there's a good argument for that. Excuse me. Oh my god, excuse me. So sorry, my uh, allergies are just popping off. Absolutely popping off. The bros of light. Ugh. Uh, let's see here. Uh, ba -ba -ba. Uh, thanks. Oh, you were gifted? Oh, hey, if, wherever you support, we I appreciate it, Shakat. Thank you. Um, have fun with Final Fantasy 1. Also, my wife says hi and thanks for... <laughs> Uh, uh, hopefully it stays that way after I, uh, all the, uh, the nose clearing that will happen with my allergies today. So, uh, much appreciated. Appreciate the, uh, support Dean, uh, supered while on the topic of FF games, while not a numbered entry, uh, tactics, uh, for the PS1 PSP is 100% recommended. It was my favorite final fantasy until 14 came along. Uh, also warrior, red mage, white mage, black mage. So wait, warrior. And then just mages. I'm not opposed to that. That sounds like a good time. Um, I played a little bit of tactics. I played a little bit of tactics. I think I talked about this on stream last week, um, but I've, I've tried it on mobile. Don't play it that way. Um, I, I, I do want to beat it eventually, and I think I want to eBay a PSP because that seems like... It seems like I had an original PSP, so I do have some nostalgia for the platform. So I think I'd like to get whatever the best PSP is considered and then uh, find a copy of tactics for Cause that sounds, that sounds all right. The mobile version doesn't exist. Yeah. It's, it's rough. I mean, you can get through it, but it's, it does not control well, uh, it, which is weird. Cause it's a, it's a grid based tactics game. You, you think it would be pretty, <laughs> it'd be pretty straightforward to make it work on a touch screen, but somehow they found a way to make it feel real cumbersome. Yeah. It's, it's not the best. It's not the best. Uh, Bellarisha, thank, oh, thank you for the kind words. Much appreciated. Hope uh, hope this is nice and cozy for you. Uh, Winkle said, I'd say it's finally monk time. Possibly. We could monk. We could monk. Uh, and Enrique is saying, Bravely Default, which is not a Final Fantasy at all, I swear. And also, Bravo Bikini. Wait, what? What are we talking about? 
why are we why are we talking about that? Okay, so I'm gonna move the keyboard for now. Ugh. Monk is a hard carry. Okay, I I think I want to have a warrior just because I feel like Tuna should be represented in some sort of sword wielding fashion. Like this warrior wield an axe like Final Fantasy fourteen and FF one. I'm not I'm not opposed to it, but I know I know Dark Knight is not an option. So four times monk is the default degen party. Oh my god, Jesus. Sword or axe. Okay. Alright, so Tuna should be a warrior, it seems like. Yeah. I'm trying to think of my of my gut feelings here. Um through Late Googling, it seemed like thieves were good. Are, are, are thieves good? Or should I just, like, monk? Uh, oh, Val should be my white mage. You're damn right. Yeah. Thieves are great. All classes are fine? Okay. Vita is the best PSP. Oh, thanks for the uh, recommend there, Amarleon. I think that's my roommate in college, right, right towards the end before I moved out. Uh, and moved to LA, bought a Vita, and modded the shit out of it. He had so many games on that thing, and it just looked like such a good time, but I was so broke. <laughs> I was so freaking broke. So I could not I could not join him in his modded PSP life. Does party order matter for enemy attack rate in this version? That's an interesting question. I don't know. I'm not sure I'm that interested in the min-maxing? I think I just want to make sure I have a, a, a pretty well-balanced party. I, I guess in the original, I, Google was leading me to believe that there were certain classes that are good for early game, and there's certain classes that are better for late game, and it talked about, like, the expense of, like, kidding out certain classes or certain jobs. Um, I mean, yeah, like, this... Like, if I was just gonna... Let's see. Like, if I was just going to go through and not think about it too hard, this would probably be my party. <sighs> this would probably be it. This would probably... Like, I feel like you should... Inter like, is healing a thing? Like, because I'm thinking... I'm looking at all of... Like, I'm looking at all these, and I'm thinking White Mage is the only healer here. Is is that is that true? Healing is a thing. Is is white mage the only one that can heal? Red mage can also heal. Okay. Okay. So red mage or white mage? Because canonically, Val is a red mage. <laughs> red mage is a poor healer. Okay. White mage is a better healer. I do. Okay. I want. I want like a hard. I want a hard healer, like a proper. A proper healer. Okay, I know, I know it's up to me, but yeah, I want to I want to let chat weigh in a little bit at least, a little bit. Uh, Red Mage is a jack, a jack of magics, master of none. Okay, all right, all right. Both red and white. Okay, that party is good. Okay, all right. Let's see. All right, let's you know let, let's give you all a little. Excuse me while I lean up. Engage my core muscles. Start a poll. Uh, how is my comp? Question mark. Great. That's whack. There we go. Start poll. Start poll. We'll just, we'll take a look. We'll take a look. Oh yeah, there we go. Uh, so that's opening up to a strong amount. Strong amount in great, in great favor. <sighs> boop, boop, boop. Jin! Uh, oh, you're tempered. Oh, you want to you want to point at our GG Thespians Midsummer Lights Dream Play, uh, where there are details in the GG Discord. That is true. There is a play coming up, put on by our wonderful, our wonderful free company. Go support our Thespians. Uh, KLG Chaos said party order determine, determines who gets hit the most. Characters on top more likely to be attacked. Okay, well then let's um. I guess we'll make this our healer. This is just how my brain works. We'll go with Val. Yes. And then we'll uh, make you a white mage. And we'll swap you back to monk. 
Then we'll make you Hithlo. All right. All right. You can reorder later. Oh, I didn't know that. Well, well, it's been done. It's been done. Okay, I, you know, I don't... I don't hate this idea. I've seen multiple requests, and I am happy to oblige. So we're gonna go with, uh... We're gonna go with JC. And... Oh, no, I do not want to return to title. There we go. Y'all happy? <laughs> Are we happy now? <laughs> I know we want JC to be a red mage, but I want a monk. So sorry, sorry, J JC. All right, uh, we're gonna roll. We're gonna roll. Now tweet it. <laughs> That's a good idea. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, let me. Uh... Damn it! It's it really. That's a good point. Uh, let's see. Let's go to Twitter, and, oh, I am logged into the Garrett and Kyle account right now. Let's see here. Yep. Perfect FF1 party. Uh, we got to tag Kyle in this. All right, the tweet is live. We have we have socialed everybody. We have successfully sh socialed. We've done it. Oh, Mir, thanks for the generous super. That's literally the comp I played with in my childhood, and what I be the game on order does matter though. Those more toward the top draw more attacks. Okay, so that's in line with what KLG was saying. You change the order anytime outside of combat. Okay, rad. And then hey, Nicholas, thanks for the super. A little bit of advice: don't give Monk a weapon. Unarmed monk is best monk. Okay. We can figure that out as we go along. I'm confirming. Wait, okay. Wait, no, why is done? Why? Why is done? Begin the game with this party. Yes, we're committing. We're doing it. All right. Let's let's settle in. Oh. world lies shrouded in darkness. Well, that's the opposite of Shadowbringers. Oh, I love, I love these kind of graphics. I really do. The winds die. The sea's rage. All right, pull my blankie up. All right, there we go. Yeah, we're getting cozy. I was like the land dying. Ah, the earth decays. Were they able to pull off this tilt effect on the NES? Because this would have blown my mind on the NES. People believe in a prophecy, patiently awaiting. When darkness veils the world, four warriors of light shall come. After a long journey, four young travelers did at last appear. And in the hand of each was clutched a crystal. Was the, was the crystal given to them when they defeated primals? Oh, shit. That looks familiar. Can you say you understand that reference if you're referencing something in the future of the reference? <laughs> or do we need a new phrase? 
I could just say, ooh, that helped me understand that reference. Crystals is a retcon. <laughs> Still counts, LMAO. <laughs> Alright, I'm not going to remember any of this. Oh, you can just toggle encounters on or off? Oh, that's fantastic. Oh, so we can choose what sprites out. I know nothing about old Final Fantasies, except that, that the Black Mage sprite is iconic. Oh, wait, what? What just happened? Oh, we're like in the town? What? Can I leave? King is searching for the prophesied warriors of light. Those are those crystals. You must seek the king at once. What? Wait, what? I want to explore the town! Getting right to it, apparently. <laughs> I, was, I was like, wait, I didn't want to get into the town yet. I wasn't ready for that. I wasn't ready for that. <laughs> Welcome, travelers. I am told you carried crystals. Is that true? Oh, look at us showing off those crystals. It's just as Luke Khan's prophecy foretold. When darkness fails the world, four warriors of light shall come. Your Majesty, we cannot be certain that these are the warriors foretold by the prophecy. Yet they stand before us with the crystals. I cannot dismiss this as mere coincidence. Crystal bearers, there is a task I would ask of you. Will you rescue my daughter, Sarah? Oh, thank God. Oh, oh, easy to pronounce Western names. <laughs> Does it stay this easy to pronounce or are we heading back into 14 territory? Garland, a knight once in his majesty's service, has abducted Princess Sarah. I ask for your aid in the name of his majesty, the King of Cornelia. Garland has taken refuge in the Chaos Shrine. Chaos! Which lies to our north. Of course, we did attempt to save the princess ourselves, but Garland is the finest swordsman in the kingdom. We have none who can match him. I have heard that you wish to journey to the cotton to our north. The bridge leading north was lost long ago, making passage impossible. If you can rescue Sarah, I will have the bridge rebuilt as a token of my gratitude. Go now, warriors of light, and do not fail me. What I was trying to say was, I know nothing about OG Final Fantasy, other than the Black Mage sprite is iconic. That's all I know. Are these doors? They look like doors. Are there secrets? Are there lots of secrets in this game? Should I go around, like, Pokemon Red, taking one step and clicking A? So like hidden shit. There are a small amount of secrets. What if I'm gonna talk to the king again? Okay. The dancing girl in town knows many odd bits of information. If you find yourself astray talk talking to her, she may know something that can put you back in course. Interesting. So in-game hint system. Okay. I love the, um, like, Microsoft blue screen of death blue background. All I know is search clocks. <laughs> okay, I guess we'll find out why. We will, uh, we will find out why. See a member message I missed from Troll and Palico. I will enjoy my romp. I will enjoy my romp. Uh, game said no care. You have to finish the game by Thursday. Okay, is that what happened? All right, good to know. Uh, I don't understand that reference, Winkle, but uh, I appreciate the super. <laughs> Perhaps I will learn it in time. In exchange for asking my daughter, I will fix my city's critical infrastructure. Super is Kura. Okay, good to know. Good to know. I just showed up. What's the party comp? How do I how do I quickly show that? Uh, we're going with. Warrior, played by Tuna. White Mage, played by Val. Monk, uh, played by JC. And Black Mage, which we named affectionately Joe Cat. Well, not played by, but I named them. 
I named them after some of my favorite Warriors of Light. Yeah. What's going on with this? Oh, of course, I got the other to Castro. Okay. All right. Uh, just you just got an empty room. Okay. Got a. Oh, we, we can swap the. Or How do we swap order? Oh, okay. Protect the ch tuna and joke. Oh, warrior's not like a front line. Okay. All right. <clears throat> so. So I, I I guess let's set a let's set a ground rule. Uh, in terms of suggestions, uh. I'm I'm happy to receive them, but but when I ask, I'll I'll ask if I want, if if I'm if I want clarification or or a tip. Um. So yeah, yeah. Um. So so how's how's let's I'm seeing. That said, let let's have a chat about the order. How's the order feeling, Marco? You're allowed to tell me how to play. I'm I'm allowed to not listen. But, but you can you can you can tell me what to do. <laughs> it's all good, Nate. It's all good. I, I I it just hit me that I should probably express my desires in terms of tips. Uh, is all is all orders good? Okay, we'll roll with this. We'll roll with this. Yeah, we'll quick save. Oh yeah. So let's use these stairs. Don't listen to our instructions. That is your only instruction. <laughs> I heard Warframe is fun. I don't have time for that right now, Marco. I got to be Final Fantasy 1 by the end of the week. I got to do it. I got to do it. Oh. See. King is searching for prophesized warrior light. Okay. All right. All right. I actually, I actually, I'm going to think out loud and I would actually, I would like an answer to this. Is it worth exploring every nook and cranny of this castle. Is it worth it? Yes? Okay. Majesty's overcome a grief. She set herself inside their chambers. Please try not to upset her. Is this her chambers? You look queenly. I am Jane, Queen of Cornelia. Please, please bring my daughter, my Sarah, back to me safely. Okay, I will. <laughs> That's cute. Makes it look like you're in the freaking bed. You want to talk to people? Sure. I was exploring. Talk to everyone. That's RPG 101. Hey, you got you got green hair. Okay. All right. All right. People seem to want me to save this Sarah. Oh shit! Click two pause. Garland was once the greatest knight in the kingdom. The power consumed him. He lost sight of who he really was. Okay. Is his first name Sid? You gotta have you gotta have blue hair. How do I get back here? I want to go talk to the wizard. How do I talk to the wizard? How do I talk to the wizard? His first name is a spoiler for another game. <laughs> is it a spoiler if I don't know it's a spoiler? It's not a spoiler if I don't know it's a spoiler. Oh, oh, here we go. Here we freaking go. What's up, wizard? Our ancestors sealed weapons within this treasure room 400 years ago. They then gave the key to the Elf King to hold to the coming of the Warriors of Light. I gotta find the Elf King. Wait, there's another wizard? Are, they're all gonna sound like Deckard Kane. Our ancestors sealed weapons within this treasure room 400 years ago. Oh, this, you got the same thing to say as the other a-hole. This door has been secured with the mystic key. Do we have a side quest? Is this a side quest? Is this how you side quest? Is this how it goes? Giving a shout out to 8-Bit Theater. I'm, I'm, I'm unfamiliar. I'm unfamiliar. But I'm glad you're feeling passionate. Oh, God. I didn't mean to do what I just did. Oh, Jesus. What is... Okay. Oh, so now I, it appears I can come and go as I please. Okay, so taking any step left or right puts me in Cornelia. So what? Okay, and I'm assuming this brings me back to the castle. 
Okay, this brings me back to the... So, okay. It appears to be nothing of note left or right. And going up... Just wait, hold on. What, what's over here? Did I go here? Sorry, everybody. I know y'all think me to be the most egregious of stallers. And that might be true. Okay, so we, we have gone there. Okay, never mind. Wander free. Okay. I'll forge ahead. Don't worry. Is there a run button? Oh, that's right. Didn't it tell me? I think. There we go. Default speed run. Ah ha ha. ha, ha. No one can stop me. This should play the bicycle music from Pokemon Red and Blue. All right. Does this also work? Oh, freaking hell. Jesus. No. I, okay. Hold on. I'm assuming. Is this, is this an overworld? Is there a run speed in the overworld? No, there's, it does not appear to affect overworld shite. Uh, encounters off, encounters on. Okay. All right. Pokemon stream one. I do not threaten me with a good time. I would, I will absolutely do a, a red playthrough. Also, I've never played past red, so I would love to actually see the other OG Game Boy games because I never, never played them. Sage Lucan said something about finding the crescent moon. Then he just up and left. Are these all like little references to like side quests? Like, I can actually pay attention to the chat now. So I heard tell that there are some side quests, but it's don't expect it to be like like more modern RPGs. RPG plot hooks, baby. It's just info. Okay. Restore the crystals of grace. It's a well. It looks like you can climb inside, but you can't really. <laughs> okay. <laughs> These look like shops. Are you a shop? Welcome. All right. How's the shop music? Because if the shop music's bad, this game is trash. I was about to ask, how do I see if it's an upgrade? So I'm assuming the green up arrow means it's an upgrade for those characters, and then... Alright, so I'm assuming there's also... What I would consider a World of Warcraft mechanic. Obviously, this is older. Significantly. Uh, so I'm assuming uh, mages can't wear leather, and only warrior can wear chain. Is that what's going on here? Is that what's going on? Yes? Okay. Got a knife, staff. So everyone's wearing clothes. Gamer senses are fully working. Wonderful. Okay. Um. Hmm. My gamer. Br oh no! I just realized my. You, you can kind of see my gill. There doesn't appear to be a safe place to put my camera. Because in battles, down there is important. But now in the shop, this I'm kind of obscuring, but... <sighs> hmm, this is fine? Okay. okay. Could have done picture in picture. Probably should have. Didn't think about that. Um, dead center. <laughs> that's Yeah, that's where I'll put it. Like, all right. So my brain would go, I'm not going to buy anything. Cause I'm going to go, I'm going to find these things out in the world, but is that actually the case? Or do I just like need to buy shit when I see shit? <laughs> you can see that I'm poor. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Buying stuff is good. Okay. Get spells. You can buy spells. Where do you buy spells? Is that the, like the other shop? So this, I'm assuming, is a weapons store. Or, yeah, let's see. Okay, so we have Nunchaka. Uh, knife, which is down for the Black Moon. Staff, which is up for the Warrior. Rapier, which is up for the Warrior. Hammer, which is up for the Warrior. And, uh, and for Val. It's the shops above these two. Okay, cool. Find anything to your liking? Oh, okay. Is 
Okay, here's a question. What do my dudes already have? How do I see what my guys have? Cannot use magic. They have nothing? Okay, so, so everyone's a melee class right now. They have nothing, we'll learn nothing. Interesting, so it's really important to buy spells then. So my, so real quick, so I understand, have an understanding. What's next store? So that's, is it like black and white magic? Is it like, is, is that the damage store and this is the healing store? I see a white mage, so. Restore a little HP, deals damage to all. So this is damage dealing. Protect. Blink, raise casters evasion. Okay, all right. I feel like I should probably have a heal. I'm going to go with a heal, and then I think I want fire. Maybe we just start with that. I only get three spells per level. So it's like one is the, is, is the level. Is that the, the limiting factor? want to like spread the love so like maybe now I also go get something like maybe I pick up the chain for my for, for tuna and then should I also just are there spells for the melee classes for the warrior and the monk No? No. So they're just full, they're pure melee. Interesting. Okay. okay so, um, oh, no, I do not. Okay. So how do I, let's see, equip. Boop. Okay, that's, that's easy enough. Chainmail, okay. All right, so everyone got something. We got a spell for both our casters, and we got a piece of armor. Can we sell the clothes that I have left over? Yeah. All right, so we're going to sell those. And Monk is worse with weapons. Okay, I, I, I was vaguely aware of that from some light Googling I did. Okay. Just a few, uh, few messages that I see pinned here. Oh, Callow, thanks for the super. Uh, I will have a good time. I will have a good time. KLG said, my one and only tip, there's a sprint button. If you want to move faster inside. I found it. Thanks for the tip, KLG. Tyler Super, fun fact, the original game was broken code-wise. Oh, shit. How so? And Serafina said... Ooh, Final Fantasy One. Hope you enjoy it. Uh, I'm I am properly in the mood for this. I wanna I wanna chill. I wanna have a good time. And this is this is this is cozy. As a, I didn't really grow up with RPGs except for the OG Pokemon, and this is giving me some OG Pokemon vibes. I'm really enjoying it. Maybe easier to say how it's broken. A lot of spells didn't work. Thief couldn't run away. Oh, great. All right. Right, I'm engaging play the game mode and we'll um if I get confused I will ask uh, for guidance you want me to rescue the princess are you the dancing girl in town I'm a dancer what's that you want to dance with me hee <laughs> hee no I want tips I don't want to dance okay I guess uh, the game feels it's made itself abundantly clear uh, with my quest at this time 
This is Cornelia, the city of dreams. Did I check in here? What is this place? I think I saw a bed. Okay, is this an inn? Can I sleep? <laughs> Running is very fast. You, I cannot sleep, at least not by interacting with a bed. Charge 30 gi- uh, What happens if I stay the night? Is this how we heal? In restores all HP and MP. Okay, it's a full heal. Gotcha. If you need to know about items, you've come to the right person. Never heard to carry a lot of potions, antidotes, and the like. Stocking up on items in advance will help you conserve your magic for the times you need it most. Now, let's move on to sleeping bags, tents, and cottage cottages. These three splendid items allow you to restore your HP and MP. You can only use them outdoors, though. In addition to these traditional items, certain pieces of equipment may be used as items as well. Okay. Once your travels, you will come across unique items that are known as key items. Some key items have an effect using a specific location. Is this the same stuff? Oh, no. Interesting. Okay, so this is just like tutorial land. That is a cozy memory, Robert. Thanks for the super and thanks for sharing. At the if you if you weren't here at the top of the stream, I uh I shared my NES memories. They're uh quite fond. Quite, quite fond. Uh, just some whiz biz? Okay. Okay. Hello, like a female dog. I'm gonna give quite the lecture on the use of magic. Yeah, I'm interested. Two scale, two schools, black and white. Hey, I already divined that. White mage is comprised of healing defensive. Black may or black magic spells are the offensive variety. Each level of black and white magic contains four distinct spells. However, any given character can only learn three of the four spells of a particular magic level. You could use the forget command to wipe your memory of any spell you've previously learned. If you want to relearn a spell you've previously forgotten, you can do that too. Okay. Yeah, let me hear types have different weaknesses. Fighting a monster's weakness will help you gain the upper hand in battle. For example, aquatic monsters are susceptible to lightning. That makes sense. I've played Pokemon before! And will deal particularly heavy damage. More effective against certain monsters. Interesting. Okay. Let's go! Think like D&D spell slots? Okay. Kyle would be better about that. I'm actually not supremely well-versed in Dungeons and Dragons. I've only played a little bit of it in my life. Okay. All the nights seem to be going on about Lucan's prophecy. Everyone else just seems to want me to save Lady Sarah. There are none in need of my servant. Oh, where did I go? Is this a church? Looks like a church. Not in need of my services. Huh. Oh, you resurrected the church. Okay. Oh, I can't get to the organ? I wanna go I wanna go interact with the organ. Okay, so so if someone actually like die dies, I gotta go to the church, not to an inn. That's good to know. Harbor City of Provoca. Provoca. These days I hear it's turned into a pirate's den. Ooh, I love pir I love me some pirates. What's this place? Tea house? Welcome! Oh, you sell shit! Do I have anything? I got a whole lot of nothing. Why do I have three staffs? Who's, who else is wielding a staff? So you got a knife. You got a staff. Should I unequip the staff? I hear a lot of people talking about unarmed. For monk. Should I unequip that staff? Yes. <laughs> get out of here. I need all the gill I can get. Stock three. Just the one, please. Play real monk. I'm 
gonna buy a potion. I'm gonna buy an antidote because seeing poison makes me sad. All right. Uh, how bad could it be? This is normally how I start RPGs. Being as frugal as possible while getting things I feel like I probably need. Wait, what? I can interact with... Take a peek at your reflection in the water. Ugh, you're filthy. Use this to wash up. What? Is that just flavor? Oh, you can go through the forest. Okay. Hey, random encounter. All goblins. Okay. What a, am I going to one shot? Right, I'm just going to assume. Oh, wait. Hold on. We got magic over oh, here. Can I go back? Yes, I can. Okay. Fire. Does magic have like. Does that pull rank on like attack speed or something? Is that why my black mage attacked first? I did not one shot. Oh, but Tuna did. Okay. One shot almost everything. Initiative roll? Okay, so it's straight at D&D. Battle music is jamming. Is there a way to pull up? Oh, crap. I did not mean... <laughs> I think I auto-battled. Yep. I was trying to... pull up the menu. This is apparently just making my mini-map bigger. What is the button for the menu? Oh, tr right trigger. That's interesting. Nope, that's not what I wanted. I was curious about... Oh, yeah. No. They got the melody right. They got the melody right. I'm going to keep this going because I want to hear the battle theme in 8-bit. It's to the north one we go, right? Oh, I love the little play. I love them trying to do bass in 8-bit. That's fantastic. Alright, how's auto battle? Let's... Wait, hold on, can I? Okay, that's controls now. Can I pull up? No, you apparently, I cannot swap music in battle. All right, and then what's on the other, how do I get to? Oh, okay, so defender flee, interesting. How's the auto battle go? Okay, yeah, this uh, this music is healing my soul. All right, cool. So that's a bop, but I, I think I do prefer the, the remastered music. It's they did a pretty damn good job. All right, and then we got boost. So you can turn random encounters off. I can up my XP. I think for now, I'm gonna keep everything on one times and we'll just abuse auto battle. All right, chat, I have a question that I do want an answer to. In terms of like learning what weapons and spells have an effect, like, you know, like crit or like our, our quote unquote super infect effective. Will the game tell me, does it have a toast like Pokemon where it'll say that was super effective or do I just need to pay attention to the damage and notice that the damage is bigger? No burst? No? Okay. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. All right, just pay attention to damage. No tell on weakness. Okay. Because when I cast fire against that one goblin, it did a shit ton of damage. Is that just because fire is a powerful spell or, or because fire 
is uh, effective on goblins. It says something like one hit or three hits. Interesting. Magic hits hard. Magic is just strong. Also, you used up both your casts of fire. Oh, you need to. Re oh, so it is. It is like it's like spell slots. So it's not an MP thing? Although I guess MP is at zero, at least for my black mage. Oh, my white mage has two. So you get like two a day, basically. There's spell slots. Okay. All right. I can vibe with that. Let's go, Omatsu Originals. Hell yeah. Oh, thank you for welcoming me to Final Fantasy Upbreaks. I appreciate it. Okay. Health does not appear to restore. We're all still level one, so I don't know if anything comes back with a level up. Whoop. Oh, that looks like a thing I want to go to. Those spiders. Ew. Black Widows. Okay. Keep it simple. It's a one hit. That's a one hit. Oh, so the monk got two. So is is. Do, am I supposed to take away from that 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 um, unarmed is super effective against spiders? Is that what I'm supposed to take away from that? Because the monk got two hits, or is that just like a crit? Monk unarmed always double hits. Okay, that makes sense. Because they're basically dual wielding because they're fighting with their fists. And we leveled up. Nice. Wow, that is, uh, that's a lot more health. Strength went up, intellect went up. Luck is the same. 56, intellect and luck went up. 25 to 26. Wait, what? <laughs> Why does Black Mage barely get any more HP? Do they just stay like made of glass? That's hilarious. They get a lot of everything, though. Strength is the only thing that didn't increase. Random level, but oh, the look, the level bonuses are random. Interesting. Oh, that one up. All right. Hell yeah. I remember that Fingleberries. Thanks for the super and thanks for coming out. Uh, now you two will be able to point at. Deet of Sacrifice, <laughs> like Leonardo DiCaprio. <laughs> yeah, I can do the, I can do the Leo point. I mean, I picked that up just looking at the damn loading screen for the, or title screen for the game. Uh, Dean, thanks for the super, said, uh, shops are the only source of spells, so make sure you load up when you get to a town. Okay, good to know. Good to know. It's possible to save scum better stats. That makes sense. I don't think I'm going to be about that life. I don't think that's how we're going to play this. Because um, there's so many other ways to kind of make this easier. You know, we, we can, excuse me, use multipliers if we want. And I will definitely be abusing auto battle when we get to grinding. But um, yeah, we'll go ahead and quick save. Actually, we can do a proper save. And I can get rid of that, uh, that file one. There we go. All right, so this is where we want to be, yes? Didn't they say go north? Ooh, I like the mist effect. Ooh, that was a cool transition. Zombie. Wait, is that... Oh, wait, is the, the four the level of the enemy or just how many there are? Is there even a way to divine enemy level? Actually asking, is there a way to know the level of your enemies? Nope, good luck. <laughs> We're just going to, um, I have no idea what the levels are, so we're just going to plow into the same target. Oh, wow. They, 
hit like trucks. They also seem to have a decent amount of uh, health. Jeez. So did I get... Oh no, okay. You do not get magic slots back from leveling up. Good to know. And then you, we're going to cast Cure on... Hardy, but it doesn't. It seems like they did more, like significantly more damage to the black mage, which makes sense. So, actually, just do need to be a little smart here. All right, we're just gonna spam. Man, dude, the monk does damage. I can see why you just want to take the weapon out of their freaking hand. Oh, and we did we level up? We leveled up. different levels of turn on dead in this game interesting yeah monk seems broke all right see that's not nearly as big of a jump in hp as one to two was okay one hp for the black mage okay cool y'all i'm uh I'm digging this. Oh, is that a door? What's in here? <gasps> leather cap? So leather is best for monk, right? We have established that that's the highest quality of armor that a monk can wear. Maybe they should start a franchise. Yeah, this Final Fantasy's got legs. Uh, you know, I'm anxious to see. I'm anxious to see if they, you know, if they turn this into a franchise. I, I think this could be. I think they got a hit on their hands. He lost stats from. How do you lose stats from equipping armor? How do, okay, hold on. Let's scrutinize this. Remove. What? Why? Why? Interesting. At least they make it easy to... Alright, so this is... <sighs> Defense goes up, but weight goes up? Interesting. Um, so how do you easily reconcile weight like is one defense worth the, the gain in weight here don't worry but yeah because my brain goes green number use use it you can just click optimal oh look at that okay well there you go okay green number use it okay alright cool How's the team doing? We're at 28, 30, 26, 26. So it seems like my gut reactions were a little low level to be in here right now. Let's uh, give Tuna a little love. Damn! Okay, never mind. Right, Nomad? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, no. F making a franchise out of this, you know, would be truly absurd. Because it's called Final Fantasy. You're absolutely right. You're absolutely right. All right, so we kind of more or less figured this out. So let's auto battle. Healed yourself. Val. Val not healing Tuna. How, how dare. So it seems like we can kind of grind in here. I do feel... I do feel a bit low level. All right, let's auto this again. So when we get good initiative rolls and we get to attack first, we're just we're just stomping these double goblin spawns. Well, why is there only one goal? I should I be afraid? I feel like I should be afraid. Burp, 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 burp. 
All right, let's just uh, do the thing. Okay, I guess I shouldn't be that afraid. Hey, we leveled up. Oh, wait, did we not all? Oh, we did. We're all level four. Okay. All right, so let's uh, play with the quick save. Safer to be afraid than not? Okay. Joe has real HP. Oh, yeah, you did. Look at that. So you're right. Yeah, you, there, you have a random chance. Also, let's... Can we look at... Ooh, look at Tuna. Tuna looking... Looking spell. Okay. All right. I just... Oh, my God. <laughs> Holy shit. Uh, may have flown a little close to the sun on this one. All right. Um, let's just, uh, try and kill the same thing. One damage? Okay, ten. That hurts. Four? You did four? Okay, well, some of them are running away, at least. Uh, okay, the, the green doggos are, um, what are they called? Were the werewolves? That's a werewolf? It just looks like a wolf. Um, okay, this is not going well. Wow, they have a lot of health. Okay. Got them now. Eee! Ocean. Okay. Probably should use that on my monk, seeing as the monk is the highest DPS member of the party right now. Yeah, I think, uh... I think we're about to learn what happens uh, when when you die, when you wipe. I'll try auto battling. Oh, see, I was curious if the monk would antidote himself because he's poisoned, but oh, it doesn't matter. Took a hit. Wow, the Warriors got some serious defense. Oh, and so our monk missed out because of fainting. Okay. Okay. So now monk is behind. Oh, interesting. Interesting. Warriors too angry to die. Yeah, yeah. My my that 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 irks my brain because I'm like, oh no, I want them to all be the same level. Um. Uh. In in general, uh, how big of a deal is it if you if you get out of sync? Other than it really just bothering me that everyone isn't. I know we can save some. Minor. Okay. All right. So we do have a fainted member of the party. And the game lets me do this. So I'm just going to run. We're just going to run and heal. That's what we're going to do. F your random encounters. We're out of here. We're heading back to town, baby. We're heading back to town. <laughs> Oh, I can't, I can't enter from behind. Okay. All right. Take that game. <laughs> as far as I'm concerned, this is me like modding in fast travel. Oh wait, no, this is the, this is the T place. You can yell phrasing all you want. You hear what you want. I'll say what I mean. Uh, yes. Oh God, it costs gill. Shit. All right. I'll, t I'll take my licks. I'll take my licks. All right. All right. And then we need to... Where's my gill? 651. So we made we made some gill. We have more gill than we started the game with. So we're going to head back over to the inn. 
Oh, this is interesting. Thanks for the super KLG. Auto battle just repeats whatever the last commands you entered were. It's for grinding with auto attacks at high speeds for the most part. Okay. Gotcha. Uh, yes, we would like to stay for the night. Oh, look at everybody dancing. Ah, oh, you're so cute. I was the kid who would grind 10 levels higher than needed and steamroll everything. I did that a lot in Pokemon. I was a big overgrinder in Pokemon. But I was also the kid who didn't look ahead, and I used my Master Ball on Articuno. So I had to save scum like crazy on Mewtwo. Funny enough, ended up getting my original Mewtwo by freezing him with my Articuno that I used my Master Ball on. Um, and was able to get him with a... What was, this, what was the second best ball? Ultra? Was it Ultra Ball? I think it was Ultra Ball. Use your Master Ball on Snorlax! Oh, yeah. Yeah, I, I had a couple friends who did that. I had a couple friends who did that. Shanietta, thanks for the five gifted memberships. Now buy equipment, please. <laughs> I mean, yeah, like, might, might as well spend the money, right? Like, I'm going to spend money until the game teaches me not to. Well, wait, hold on. So we've, let's see. You're already wearing leather. You already got chain. And Okay, so we don't, armor is fine. Caught a gift, Yoshi? Hell yeah. yeah. If you catch a gift, make sure you send a thank you to whoever gifted him. In this case, Shanietta. All right, so that's a trap. Already got the knife. Rapier appears to be a pretty sizable upgrade. It's only eight? Well, pfft. let's go. Do we want to give a hammer to the white mage? Are, are there things like, like spell staves and shit like that for... Yeah, yeah, just go for it. Okay, all right, let's do it. Okay, and then let's equip... Hammer, there we go. And now we can sell knife. And shouldn't we have a staff to sell? Yes, we have a staff we can sell. We don't want to sell an antidote. Okay. He's a healer, but. <laughs> All right. And then we should be able to buy. Let's see. Might as well get thunder in case we find anything that's water based. How are we doing on money? Okay. Lowers enemies evasion. I like sleep. I I really like sleep in RPGs. Um, so I would I would sleep over focus here. Right, and then let's go get Val some goodies. Oh shit! <laughs> Sorry, I was adjusting the mic. You like sleep IRL? So do I. I slept great last night. I, I love getting a good night's sleep, and I've, I've been having uh, some pretty inconsistent sleep later. So we got Cure. Does this mean no one can get... Oh, no, no, no. The check mark means they have it. That does look like the white mage is flicking people off. <laughs> Deals damage to all undead enemies. That seems good. Raise one ally's defense. Raises caster's evasion. Hmm. So when it says caster versus ally, I'm assuming this can only be cast on the white mage and this can be cast on anybody or is it, or because it says ally, is it only be able to cast on other people but not the white mage themselves? Correct, 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 correct. Okay, ally equals everyone, okay. So here I would pick up uh, Dia and protect and I would probably leave Blink out. plan? Okay. Right. I'm going to go with my gut on this one. Okay. And then let's buy a, a few more potions and antidotes, shall we? Because we know we know poison is on the menu. We know poison is on the menu. So let's, uh, let's get a few more antidotes. Let's get at least enough that everyone in the party can antidote at least once. And then let's uh, do that. There we go. Oh shit, sleeping bag. I think I may have spent too much. Do I have anything I can sell? No. Uh, 
my sleeping bag. Oh, it's 50. Okay. Okay. Let's get a sleeping bag. All right, there we go. Should have gotten the black mage knife. Okay. Well, when we make some more gill, sir, you are blocking my exit. Thank you. Go ahead and turn encounters back on. So what, what level we at? We're also gonna do a proper save. I'll leave that too, I don't know why. The way my brain works. I mean, you're all pretty basic at this point, so we can kind of just... Oh yeah, we're just... Bye! Oh, his knife only one or two go. We've gone too far. I'll get it later. What? Wait, crazy horse. Oh, God. Wow. They take a lot of damage. I shouldn't have auto-battled this. Mistakes were made. I love seeing how little the damage is on the warrior. It's it's fantastic. You can un-auto-battle. Okay. Hey! Oh wait, I didn't. Oh, I didn't want to defend. I should probably die now, so probably no point in uh, overthinking it. Yeah, there we go. All right, so JC is really close to leveling. Items, ocean. On JC, get it back up. All right, there we go. It beat a cancel action. Okay. Yeah, well, let's uh, let's let's at least get. Shit, did not mean to go in here. Let's at least get uh, JC level before we head back into the spooky place. I'm currently using no boosts. I'm not against them because I do. I would like to get through this relatively quickly. But I also kind of want to see how it feels without any boosts before I make any decisions. Let's just go ahead and auto battle this because they're basic ass goblins. And everyone base just kind of one shots them, regardless of job. All right, come on, come on! More random battles, more random encounters. JC's got a level. Before we go into the spooky place. What? Skeletons? I haven't seen these yet. Alright, well let's uh, see what basic attacks do. Oh, okay, they're... They're nothing. They're nothing. goblins take more of a hit. Right. One more should do it on JC. Oh, good to know, Vala. Seeing the white mage with the hammer is cute. All right. And everyone else is ready to level as well. Cool. All right. Now I like the idea of encounters off. We're just going to go top everybody off. We're just going to go top everybody off before we head back into the spooky place. Let's go make a, our first real honest push into the dungeon. Chaos Shrine? Is that what it was called? I think it was called Chaos Shrine. Nope. Oh, Freaking hell. Oh, Beal. 
<laughs> buy, buy the Black Mage Knife? Okay. All right. Just for you. Just for you. Why does it say down? Why is it, why is knife down for the black mage? It has more accuracy. Oh. Are we still, what the hell just happened? I think, I think, I think we're back. Am I back? <laughs> Are, are we back? Am I back? Okay. Oh, thank God. Okay. Um. So this this shit wireless keyboard that I'm using because I'm leaning back. It, it has a power button, and it locked the computer. <laughs> so we're gonna we're gonna turn this off. We're t we're turning this off now. We are turning this off now. Also. I'm going to, I'm going to sit up for a little bit. My posture, my posture can be felt. My posture can be felt. I'm very aware of my posture right now. Oh, so we're going to, uh, we're going to do a posture check, everybody. Ah, that was terrifying. All right. Uh, we appear to be working again. All right. Uh, but the game is very confused. I cannot tab into the game. There we go. Oh, no. Now my, my controller appears to also be having a moment. All right. There we go. Oh, I've been using a controller. I've, I've just been using the keyboard to just, like, see messages and, and do anything I need to do in chat. Oh. All right. Let's see. So, back to the conversation we're having. Why do I want a knife? If it's a red arrow on my black mage, everyone's yelling knife for black mage, but the game is telling me it's bad. Why is the game telling me it's bad? Is it does it only care about attack or defense? It's not programmed for complex analysis. Okay. All right. So I understand now. I'm going to buy a knife and equip it on. Oh, so it doesn't, it doesn't know. Optimization either. All right. All right, so we're going to turn counters back on. So if I push into the... Okay, yeah, so if you push into a character, they move. Thanks again, Vala. Kung Fu Black Mage. Accuracy determines hit count, which is damage as well. Thanks for the tip, Callum. Right. What are you? A gigas worm. Warrior's hitting pretty damn hard, too. All right, so gigas worm. Take some hits. Leveling up. Bum, 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 All right. Before we go through that door, I want to explore around. So if I just auto battle, auto battle, it assigns hits. Right? No one, like, it's on auto defense or any bullshit like that. Right? Okay. So we fought the spiders. They're pretty basic. Alright. Keep encounters on for now. Skeletons. Are they more dangerous than the skeletons outside? Does not appear to be. Auto repeat your last command even between even between um encounters? Oh, I need the mystic key. Okay. Yes? Okay. All right. Good to know. Woo! 
I'll just uh, spam this worm to death. I'm gonna hold my spells because they seem uh, precious. Shy Hulud. Oh, hey, zombies. I think with the levels we've gotten, we should just be able to auto these guys. Yeah, okay. Cool. What about this door? I need that mystic key. Anything up here? Nope. Random encounter down here, though. One spider! Have you seen what I've been doing to your kind? I tried to flee. Okay. Yeah. How are we doing on health? 83, 43, 52, 66. I'm fine with that. I'm fine with that. Oop. Nine. Hitting for nothing. God, the monk, man. The freaking monk. Basic ass skeletons. Get one shot. Hey. Ooh, hello. Potion. Okay. I thought this said teeth for a second. Tent. What the hell? Is tent also for sleeping? Oh, so tent also restores... Oh, spell slots. That's freaking great. Oh, that's good. Oh, you can't sleeping bag when you're in a dungeon. Okay. Interesting. All right, so let's go see what that door is about. Wolf. Okay. Well, let's see if auto attacks get the job done. JC's getting low. All right. Let's uh use a potion. There we go. I don't want to be that Captain America meme of, so you saved all your items until you needed them, and now you've beaten the game. I don't want to be that person. Well, we're going we're gonna to take some damage. If they keep attacking Tuna, though, we'll be good, because Tuna's armored out the ass. Yeah, keep attacking my warrior. Auto battle in a game like this is... Oh, it's delightful. I would like this for Pokemon, please. Oh, did, that, did I see like a Lich? All right, so every Gigaswarm we've come up on has died from a full round of basics. Okay. You look spooky. That looks like X-Death. All right, so let's... Quick save. Also, I think we're pretty close to a level, and this room is spooky. So let's um, let's go out here. Let's do a proper save. Mm, override this. That's fine. Um, how are we doing on everybody? I haven't used any spells, and health. We're all pretty healthy. I'm good with those. We're just gonna send it, and see what happens. Uh, maybe we'll uh, pop a few more random encounters before we get in the door here. Uh-oh. We got two Gigas Worms. 15 damage on Tuna. That's, that's, that ain't nothing. Okay. It should be... Okay, we're really close to a level up. Really close to a level up. Eric, thanks for the German super. Ending the game with 99 of every item and never having an issue, or and never having used them like a hoarder, I feel called out. Uh, it's usually me, too. I don't, and I don't, I don't, oh, they got initiative. Okay. They're just the blue goblins. We should be able to uh, 
brute force them down. Yeah, there they go. Wait, do we all level up? We're all level six. Okay. Oh, wait, no, level next level in six. Okay, yeah, let's let's keep uh the old back and forth. The old scrub of scrub up dub. Just melting them. Look at this. When we walked in here, I was afraid of ghouls. If you really need that potion, <laughs> what if you really need that potion on the final boss? Exactly. Exactly. How's everyone? All right. So we could potion up a bit. Let's uh, give Tuna some hit points and let's live dangerously with Val. Hit it with a quick. Oh shit! Hit it with a quick save. Okay. Let's see. Oh, this is Garland. Okay. I mean, I guess the game was telling me it was Garland. The king will have no choice but to exchange the kingdom for his daughter's life. Cornelia will be mine. Who's there? Hm. The king's lapdogs. Do you have any idea who you're messing with? You really think you have what it takes to cross swords with me? Very well. I, Garland, will knock you all down. Lapdogs, all of you. Oh, I like this sprite. You fancy. All right, so you're just going to attack. We're going to be smart with our attacks now. You're just going to attack. You. Covered in armor, so I feel like... I feel like lightning. I feel like lightning is the way to go here. You know, right? They're wearing armor. You know, you know what it is? Yeah. And then, what do we got for magic here? You're not undead, so I think we're just gonna just gonna do a a gentleman's attack from Val. Thirty-eight. Okay. Ooh, Thunder's got a nice attack or uh, like attack graphic. Val doing his best. Did he not attack? Did I miss it? Are we going to continue with the attacks? I mean, I don't see any reason not to use. Just, like, throw everything I got. Garland missed? Okay. We'll just keep attacking. Oh, there's 16. Okay, that's not terrible. 16 on the Black Mage. Oh, there we go. What a chump! We're going to do is this dissolve effect, but it's going to be with pixels. You didn't even have enough XP to level JC. <laughs> Cower at the power of my monk. Oh, we saved the princess. That's a great, it's a great game, everybody. Thanks for coming by. You, you've come to rescue me. I am Sarah, princess of Cornelia. Words could never be enough to thank you. That's the first time anyone's ever defeated Garland. You must allow me to show my gratitude. Please accompany me to Castle Corne Cornelia. Oh wait, what's that cool crystal ball thing about? No, we're not gonna... We're not gonna address it? Okay. Thank you for returning my daughter to my side. There can be no doubt that you are the Warriors of Light from Lucan's prophecy. You should hear the prophecy in its entirety. <clears throat> if I may. When darkness veils the world, four Warriors of Light shall come. If they cannot gather the Shards of Light, the darkness will consume all. The four crystals will never shine again. Now I hear that a crystal can be found on the continent to our north. Restoring light to the crystals is our only hope of ridding the world of the monsters which plague it. I will have the bridge to the north rebuilt as I promised. I pray that you succeed in restoring light to the four crystals and to the world. <laughs> Hail 
Hell yeah. Wait, just a moment. This loot has been entrusted to the Princess of Cornelia for many generations. Oh shit, we're going Ocarina of Time, y'all. When he abducted me, Garland took this loot as well. I want you to have it. It may aid you on your journey. We're becoming a bard, everybody. All right. What you got to say? Well, I know this already. You got nothing new to say, do you, Chancellor? If you wanted, you could. I mean, here in Cornelia. No, it's nothing. You should make preparations for your journey. Restore light to the crystals. Oh. You uh, you looking for a suitor? Is that what's going on? Thera's thoughts are always with you. Okay. All right. You say something new? Ah, oh, thank you. You're welcome. You're so welcome. Is this on the Switch? No, I'm playing it on PC. Got my uh, Xbox controller here. All right. Anything change? Is there some new shit around the castle? Anything new? Oh, what's the queen got to say? Question is, which party member is she down bad for? <laughs> I don't know how I could ever thank you. Okay, so the queen does change dialogue. Noise. All right, so we want to go to the north. Oh, are we shipping? Are we shipping the, the princess with, with, with Jesse? Is that is that what we're doing? Oh, we get... We get a cinematic. First cutscene. Let's go. Orders from His Majesty. We're to do our part to fulfill Lucan's prophecy. <laughs> Games will never look better than this. That's actually pretty charming how they've done the graphics here. There's some unique pieces. Build that Talos. Yeah. Y'all need a trolley. A trolley would do great. Somebody need to get these men some trolleys. What does this bridge have to do with the prophecy? The four warriors of light are here. They're here in Cornelia. Okay. Oop, wait. Did I want to go to the overworld? Did I heal up? Nope. No, we want to heal up. Bop. Yeah. Look at everybody dancing. All right. Uh, items. Potions 2. What's our gill at? 875? I like that every time I come back to town, I have more gill than I started the game with. That feels good. So what? That's 150 HP. What's everyone's HP up to now? 150 would kind of be overkill still at the point we're at. So let's just buy a couple. And go up to like... Let's again. Let's just stock four. Do you sell tents? What's the tent versus... Buy another tent. I feel like this will be nice out in the world. All right. Um, and uh, here's a. I have a question. I would actually like an answer on. Do, does does are the items locked in each town? Like they don't get new items over time. I'm assuming I just need to explore to find better items in in later towns. They do not update now. Oh, is there ether? Okay, shit. I'm assuming it works like it works in Pokemon. Get out of my way, dude. Oh. One HP for each magic level. I'm still a little fuzzy on what the hell that even means. Oh, man. Ether's expensive. I'm just going to trust that we get more gold. I'm just going to trust. I'm going to believe. All right, we want to head north. Should probably do a proper save. What's going on here? Oh, shit. Oh, that's cool. I'm a little, uh, 
improved 8-bit cutscene. Oh, we're going to do some scrolly text. The music is chill. I'm digging it. And so their quest began. As the four warriors of light, they felt overwhelmed by the great task destiny had placed before them. They did not even know the true significance of the four crystals they held in their hands. The crystals that once, long ago, held a light that shone so brilliantly. The time for their journey had come. The time to cast off the veil of darkness and bring the world once more into light. This is the Final Fantasy theme, by the way. Well, damn. I always thought it was like the 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 harp at the beginning, like the load screen. Lyra, thank you. Uh, yeah, yeah. It's cl- thanks for coming, everybody. We've already beaten it. Um, I appreciate it. That's Prelude. Okay, yeah, I always thought of that as the Final Fantasy theme. My chord is very tangled. All right. Now I feel like I should properly save so we don't need to sit through that again in case I screw something up. (laughs) New land and you accost me with basic-ass goblins? Get wrecked, goblins. We killed Garland. Oh, no. Don't use Thunder. Oh, crap. <laughs> I forgot how auto battle worked. Well, I feel his penance. All righty. Now, we're living with our choices, unless they're truly bad choices. We're living with our choices. Oh, no. My hubris. Yeah, we just want basic attacks for goblins. Basic attacks, party. Basic attacks. Okay, so there's nothing over here. It's up on the pen. Ooh, what are, what are you? I keep wanting to hit start. To, to bring up the thing and save, but it just it just resizes your damn your damn map. Now Rock Oracle, I think this is Shadowbringers. They keep talking about, you know, a world plunged into darkness. But they keep saying it like it's a bad thing. I'm very confused. I'm waiting for Ardbird to show up. Hold on. Hold on. Holy shit! I was like, hold on, this music sounds familiar. Sure enough. This is in the first freaking Final Fantasy? The first Final Fantasy? Man, I had people hit me up in DMs being like, don't don't get too excited. It's not very story driven. I, I don't know. I'm like like don't get too excited. Freaking Matoya's in this. Matoya's like my one of my favorite friggin' things about Final Fantasy fourteen. Hell yeah, reverse nostalgia. Yeah, that is a great thing to call this. Yeah. Ouch. Do you look like one? To, eh, kind of. You got a big hat at least. You're not purple though. My eye. My eye. Ouch! What is she doing? What are you doing? I can't see a blasted thing without my crystal eye. Who could have stolen it from me? Huh. No frogs, sadly. Can I, uh, can I rob Matoya blind? Well, that's actually kind of mean, because she's missing a crystal eye. I take that back. It's very insensitive. Okay, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna steal all your shit. 
It's going to steal all your shit. Can I break pots like Zelda? No. Shh. It's unfortunate. Any books? Nope. And no, the knock, the knock, swish, swish, a room. Okay. You all, y'all say the same thing? Yep. Okay. Mad Eye Matoya. <laughs> Can I sit in Matoya's chair? I'm in charge now. Okay. Well, hold on. We're going to engage uh, talking like Captain America over the chair. My eye. That's it? That's all you got to say? Okay. So I'm just supposed to divine that if I find a crystal eye that I bring it back here. Okay. All right. Better listen to the... Br Is there a secret with the brooms? No, Lidna, Leknak. Is the spell different? No. Is there going to be a question about what spell at some point? Is the bed interactable? Nope. Same as the other ones. Okay. Okay. All right. Um, well, Matoya, I guess I'll try and find your eye. Um, you seem concerning. We'll, uh, we'll open with some basics and see how it goes. Three. It did three. 29 damage to my poor monk. Okay. All right. So they do hit kind of hard, but not the worst thing in the world. A level seven, except for JC, who is about, whose leveling is imminent. Oh boy. Warg wolf. Right, let's uh, focus the thing that scares me and see how it goes. Mm, you all rode quite high. Okay, so less than 80 health. Or ish, lady 80 ish health. Hardy wolves. Geez, they're uh, whooping up on my monk. Just a, a potion is called for. All right. Oh, wait, shit. I didn't notice how much more MP my casters have. It's way better. So the game marks points of interest with yellow dots. That's good. Uh, we'll just fire off with some attacks. Oh, don't attack my black mage. He's a sensitive boy. Don't you see his low armor value? Yeah, I think we can risk it a little bit longer. Yeah, in terms of puzzles and stuff, I'll, I'll ask if I want some clarification. Uh, so far. Hmm. I don't have any, like, AOE yet. Let's go ahead and make sure we kill the, the scary thing. Ninety-nine. Damn. Okay, so Thunder's gonna hit something else, but that's fine. Right. 
Sleep is a oh, sleep is AOE. Interesting. Hadn't tried it yet. Okay, close to a level. Is there anything up on here? Nope. It's a trap. Just wants to get me more random encounters. Oh, hey, there's a town. Shit. Lizard, you're terrifying looking. I think they have higher than normal defense, but uh, dies. Nope, please. It fled. It fled. <laughs> Tear you. I see what you're doing. Thanks for the super. And yeah, like the stream, everybody. If you like what you're seeing. I'm seeing some Discord notifications. I'm just going to make sure everything's okay in mod chat. Just going to make sure everything's going okay. Okay, nothing's in mod chat. Nothing's in mod chat. All right. All right. All right. Okay, let's see here. No XP Sag? Yeah. Let's see what this town is about. What's this place called? Oh, it's it's Pravaka. So please help us. Uh, okay, what's wrong? What's wrong, bud? Have the have the punks moved in? Nice mohawk, dude. Those blasted pirates, they're running around locating uh lo sorry, looting and pillaging. Like they own the place. Oh, so the pirates are they're not friendly pirates. Hey, you look like pirates. But hold on, I feel like the game wants me. Well, this is the inn. Although, Topinoff does seem wise before talking to the pirates. Okay, there's nothing else going on in here. It's just beds. Okay. Okay, here's a res. You're a cat, but I don't see a cat. Okay, we can buy some new stuff. Blind nah? Cures darkness. Why? What is darkness? And why do I need to cure it? Silence seems important. Shit, stuff got very expensive suddenly. This is lightning damage by half for the entire party. Raises one ally's evasion. Huh. Huh. Okay, I ain't gonna buy anything until I understand what my other options are with the extremely limited gill I currently have. Find anything to your liking. Oh shit, Blizzard. I damage to one enemy. Ah! Okay, so darkness is like a blind spell. Okay. Raise one ally's attack. Slow reduces all enemies' number of attacks. That actually seems like a decent piece of kit since it looks like it's AoE. Alright, so everything is baseline 250 from here on out. So we want to go out and grind for Gil... Oh, shit. Better gear. Oh, my God. Oh, God. What do I want? My warrior can use all of this except for hammer. And we already have hammer. So. Your broadsword, battle axe, scimitar. I mean, I'm a broadsword. I'm a broadsword kind of guy. Anything I can get rid of? No. All right. So we need to go grind some gill is what I'm seeing. That's what I'm learning from this up in this corner. No, oh, okay. All right. Marco, that is a, a kind observation. Um, yes, I, uh, I'm, I'm freaking stunned that this many of you have shown up for this. Uh, someone let uh, uh, 1K uh, MSQ Andy commenter know. <laughs> Don't actually do that. It's fine. 
They don't have to be down for the way I play games, and that's totally fine. <laughs> All right, is this going to be like Pokemon? No? No? I can walk in front of you? You don't get mad? Okay, it's not like Pokemon. Cool, let's see what else is for sale. Welcome. Anything new for sale? Here's stone. What if you want to be stoned? Cure silence. Cure darkness. Eye drops cure. That's actually kind of cute. Oh, shit. Phoenix down. Oh, but that's a thing. Yeah. Damn. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. Man, we need money. We need money. So here's the thing. Here's the, I'm like, I, like my, my gut, my gut feeling is to avoid the multipliers, but I already feel over leveled a little bit. So it's like, I almost want to up the gill multiplier a little bit so that I'm not so horrendously over level that, that some of this combat is just trivial. Cause it feels like I'm going to need to grind a lot for gill. Um, but that will cause me to be over level. It might, at least in this opening salvo of the experience of the game, it feels like you, you level up faster than you get gill. Now, granted, we did buy a decent amount of stuff. Um, but, but yeah. Yeah. That will change? Okay. Grinding for all the gear is usually a little too, bit too much. You can cut XP gain in half if you want. That's interesting. Yeah. F, F, FF1 was mostly a guild grant. So that's interesting. Yeah, I'm seeing some, some mixed thoughts around here. Um, but uh, none of it seems like a fight, which I appreciate. Y'all, uh, thanks for being good to each other. And then we got... Oh, shit. We can upgrade armor. Oh, I could use a shield. I, I'm assuming I don't want to use a shield, though, if I'm going for broadsword, right? Is it, Am I right in assuming that broadsword is a two-handed weapon? All, all weapons are one hit. What? You can broadsword and shield? Shit. Leather gloves seem like a no-brainer. Because <laughs> everyone can use it and they're only 50 gil. There are no two-handed weapons. Okay. Should I just buy everybody leather gloves? <laughs> Crit, I've, I've, I've seen you on social. You're, you're, you're too kind to throw hands. You're too kind. Gill grind was how they lengthen the playtime in these NES games. Okay. Be their leather daddy. Okay. Oh, I'm trying to farm gill to buy shit. Okay, yeah, that's that's kind of how I'm feeling, except monk. I'm gonna just everyone, you're all getting leather gloves. So why? Oh, hold on. Why can they wear leather gloves but they couldn't wear a leather chest piece? Jesse is anti-close. Okay. Yeah, I noticed he the only member of the party that didn't have a green arrow when it came to the... I'm, I'm uh, in terms of not getting one thing versus not getting another, always assume I'd, I'm paralyzed by indecision. I'm not always buying things because of a conscious decision. I'm sometimes not buying things because I'm like, oh God, I need so much more gill. I need so much more gill. I guess it is only 12, though, right? Yeah. That's a good point. My brain went into shit expensive, yo. And uh, optimal. Should I equip that shield? Hell yeah. It's a vibe, man. All right, let's uh, save and talk to those pirates. I'm sure nothing bad will happen. Just what a what be you doing here? You wouldn't be looking to make trouble with Beaky's be be Beaconeers? What? Beaky? Bikey? <laughs> How are we pronouncing that? Bikes? Didn't know we were Limsa. Okay, you're saying the same thing. BK? Okay. Bick? Alright, alright. Bucky? 
You've got cannonballs of steel to be taken on the great pirate bikey Keelhaul. Uh, Keelhaul them, boys. I thought Keelhaul was the last name. Aye, aye. That's a lot of pirates. Oh, we can try a thing. We can try a thing. Uh, let's do that. Let's just focus this magic sleep. There we go. Then... Oh, I didn't... Wait, shit. I didn't mean to assign an attack there. That's a lot of pirates. Okay, so they don't have a... A ridiculous amount of health. So Black Mage rolled pretty low on the initiative there. Okay, so it missed three of them. So it has individual chances to hit and or miss. I'm assuming damage would wake up the L shape of pirates that were affected by sleep. Thunder is a very satisfying sprite. I like the effect. All right, we're just gonna brute force from here on out. Down we go. 109, Monk is bonkers. Stop about that. Here we go. Level up everyone except JC because non-aesthetic things. I, I'd be most sorry. Oh, cr any any input at all skips a dialogue. Any input. I barely tapped a joystick, and it was like, next line. I want you to take me ship for your troubles. Can you find it in your heart to forgive an old pirate? Yeah, I'll take a ship. You obtain a ship. <laughs> uh, mods, if we could time out Marco for uh, all caps. If we just, uh, just time out. Time out Marco for all caps. Uh, you know, I don't know who this Marco guy is. He seems like he's seems like he's uh, he's here to cause trouble. <laughs> Do not actually time out Marco. We get gil for that. We did get some gil for that. I feel like you know I I want to spoil Tuna first, so I'm gonna go buy a broadsword. Is what I'm gonna do because. It's my OC, damn it. Oh no, this is this is black magic. Okay. I'm gonna broadsword first. I don't care if this is bad min maxing. Yeah, broadsword. Now we're uh, we're doing our best Dark Knight impression. Is rapier an upgrade for anyone else? How do I see? No. Let's see. Yeah, no. Okay, no one else can use it. We don't want to put a weapon on him. So, let's go ahead and sell that rapier. But you could have an axe. I, I'm a sword guy. Always been a sword guy. Always gonna be a sword guy. I had enough guilt for like one spell. <sighs> Here's how I live my life. I live my life in fear. In RPGs. In games like this, I live my life in fear of shitty status effects. And so I feel a pull to blind Nuh. I do not want any of my warriors of light to be affected by blindness and not be able to do anything about it. So this is, I think, the first 
level two I want to get. Why would I buy eye drops when I could spend two fifty and be and and have infinite eye drops as long as I have magic spell slots? That's that's this is how my RPG brain works. Here's a view into my mind and how I play these games. That's how I do that. That's how I do that. Okay. Oh, so so I know it's limited, but since this is level two, I'm not competing with my level one spells. Is that how this works? So when I when I'm in combat next, will I have like a level one section and a level two section? Okay, that that slaps. That freaking slaps. How does this look in? Oh yeah, look at that. Oh my god, it goes all the way up to level eight. Holy shit. Okay. Okay. So how do I use the boat? Is there anywhere else I could go that I'm missing? What's up with this guy? I don't fear the pirates anymore. Oh, you're well. You're welcome, random citizen. You're welcome. Since everybody gets to say, there are elves living across the sea. Hell yeah. Elf princess is sleeping, huh? Well, okay, so uh, hair color appears to be um, locked dialogue options or locked dialogue. Everyone with the same hair hair color has the same. Dialogue. I wish I could have a mohawk. I wish I could customize my warrior of light. Oh, wait, well, who's this guy? We didn't talk to the wizard. How do we get to the wizard? I fled from Melmont, town to the west. Truly pitiable sight. The earth routes and monsters attacking in the night. Is there nothing you can do? I mean, I'm, I'm working there, man. I'm, I'm, I'm on a quest. Jeez. Got backseaters in game. Oh, there's my ship. Okay. Okay. Uh, urge to see what I can see without getting on the ship intensifies. Tarantula. These are different from the Black Widows we fought. So let's just queue up a bunch of attacks and see what happens. Two? Did I just hit for two? Four? Okay, tarantulas. Uh, don't seem to... Oh, God. Poison. Great. Oh, yeah, I don't have anything that can... Uh, I don't have a spell that cures poison. Swing that broadsword. Here we go. Uh, so who's like me? Oh, is this just... Oh, it's like Pokemon shit. And you're like, I could use an item, but instead, I'm just going to hightail it back to town. I mean, yeah, I, I understand that the poison would linger, but I, I guess I didn't expect it to do damage as I walked. But. Oh, wait. Oh, what? You stay poisoned on sleep? What? Oh, that is evil. That is goddamn evil. So the, you got no recourse but to just burn antidotes. That's it? That is old school. Yeah. Church heals poison? Oh, I thought it was just for resing. Okay. Wait, who, who the fuck is still... Fuck's sake. <laughs> Moving too fast. I moved past it. Wait, what? No, no, it doesn't. It does not, apparently. That That is... We got, we got, we got stream logic. We got stream logic. Doesn't work. <laughs> Lying liars. Well, you, you can't say you got one guide if you got multiple guide. 
or 91 or it's a 90, whatever, whatever. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. We're just going. Oh, you're thinking of Dragon Quest. Okay. Never played a Dragon Quest. Maybe I'll get up to that one day. Get out of my way. Just got poison. This is Out of my way. Val's poisoned and cranky. Uh, all right. Uh, we want to see what's down here before we jump in the boat. Who thinks? So what's up with, with Matoya's crystal eye? Is that a thing? I, okay. Uh, let me let me phrase this. Don't give me hardcore answers until I come up with the way I want to actually phrase this. Sorry, Catter should be on because we're not backtracking. Um... Excluding the, is is whatever's happening with Matoya, is that a thing I can do before the boat? Or do I need the, just yes or no, is it a thing I can do before the boat? No, no, okay. Okay, cool, that's all I wanna know. That's all I wanna know. Okay, we're just going to brute force, and then auto battle the shiz. That broadsword is nice. God, the mages do, like, no damage to these guys. Welcome to the level 7 club, Jesse. What's over here? Anything of note? Anything of note? Oh, boy. Three of them. Ooh, the uh, the warg wolves take some hits. One fifteen, really bad. Didn't really want to double sleep, but hey, that's the risk of auto battle. Now we can just brute force the rest of these down. Although, our black mage is getting low. Nice. Nice. Anna said, don't you love finally being able to cure one status effect in the first fight getting hit with the one thing you didn't buy a cure for? I do, Anna. Them's just classic RPG things. Just classic RPG things. We could let our Black Mage get a little lower. There's so many things from Super. If Final Fantasy is the series that innovates with every game, Dragon Quest is a series that stays pretty much the same mechanically. Huh, I don't know. Oh, we can. Uh, there is more down here. Dun, dun, dun. All right, nothing there. That ain't nothing but Florida. That's what that is. That's a whole bunch of Florida. One thirty-two. My name is Garrett, and I love my monk. Needs more gators. That's fair. That's fair. Okay. All right. So. Whatever is is this intrigue to the southeast. I can't get there on feet alone. All right, we're going to try. Can we flee? Everyone has to flee? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. All right, never mind. We're going to auto battle. Oh, wait. Oh, we all tried to flee. <laughs> I mean, I need Gil. What are we up to? 810. We need a lot more gill, because I want all those spells. I want all those spells. So we need like at least 250 per spell. I'm gonna queue up a bunch of ghasts. Alright, we're gonna queue up a bunch of attacks and see if if we get punished. Alright, this appears to be going fine. Uh, it's 250, and if I wanna buy six spells, I already bought one. So that'd be Five, oh, so four would be a thousand, and five would be one thousand two fifty. But there was also some armor and shit we wanted as well, so I should probably aim for like two thousand gil. 
Uh, where are my meeps at? Thanks for the super. Um, I mean, eventually I'd like to get through all, all Final Fantasies. I'm not declaring that... Uh, I'm, I'm not making any sort of declaration that I'm definitely... Like, from this point on, like, mainlining nothing but Final Fantasy games till I'm done in any particular order. I'm, I'm probably going to dance around in the order that they interest me. Um, and uh, Kyle's back soon, so we're going to get back to Final Fantasy XIV MSQ, which does uh, eat up a lot of our time when we're doing that, because we're always making videos in tandem. Um, but I'm thoroughly enjoying this. I'm also really... I'm, I'm, this week sounds cozy to me. I'm really excited to get to focus on, like, one game and just, like, kind of mainline it this week. I'm looking forward to it. So, but we'll see. Yeah, I do eventually want to play all the Final Fantasies. But uh, declaring any, getting it done in any sort of, like, specific amount of time or anything like that, uh, that's, that's not what I'm here to do. I don't think I can skirt this. Nope, no, I cannot. All right. But let's just, uh, grind some gill. Grinding gill. We're changing the name of the, sh of the channel soon, everybody. To grinding gill. These are kind of basic ass enemies. We're just gonna go for it. Oh, though, oh shit, our black mage is low. I missed that. But luckily, we just uh, murdered everyone dead and uh, moved on with our lives. Okay, let's go ahead and hit our black mage with one of these. Yeah, that's the grinding gear crypto stream. Uh, yeah, I wouldn't expect any one of those anytime soon. Listen, I, you know, I, I have morals to a certain price point, so if someone wanted to give me a truly dumb amount of money to uh, advertise their crypto bullshit, I, I wouldn't say no, but it would need to be a dumb amount of money. And you would all be entertained on the other side of it when I do stupid things with the stupid amount of money. Um, but then someone would clip this where I'm calling crypto uh, crypto bullshit. And yeah, you know, it's all, it's all out there on the internet. It's all out there on the internet. Yeah. He means car channel. <laughs> I would buy a truly ridiculous exotic car uh, and do a, like a Merweb Atasha with like a Lamborghini or something. That's, uh, I want you, I want you, I want to be very clear with you that, you know, when we become YouTube millionaires, uh, I will be horribly irresponsible with my money. Just so you know. Grinding Top Gear. There you go. That's what, that's what the channel will be called. That's what the channel will be called as we grind some gill. <laughs> sure as shit ain't buying crypto 10 years later. <laughs> I do wish I had gotten, on, gotten in on uh, Bitcoin, really. I remember the early days of Bitcoin and like legitimately finding it fascinating listening to some tech shows, like tech podcasts. Ooh, this seems like a recipe for poison disaster. Uh, oh, and Val is very hurt, and I wasn't paying attention because we were laughing about Merweb Lamborghini Atasha. <sighs> oh, God. Oh, jeez. Oh, Ooh, this scares me. Um, no point in being scared, though, until we actually know we should be scared. Um, let's, uh, let's kill these. Let's kill, let's kill these effers. Let's just, uh, go ahead and kill yourself, Val. 33! Oh! Okay. Alright, uh, that was not enough for a one-shot. That is not what you want to see. 61, okay, not enough for a one-shot. And we got poison on our warrior. I repeat, poison on our warrior. So maybe let's go with the and then we're gonna find it and this is why we got you. Please don't kill my party. And I don't okay, four hits, 106, there we go. You know, I'm now thinking about the mid back oh shit. No! I'm now thinking about min-maxing the antidote and should probably wait until after the end of a poison encounter because the poison has a chance to just get reapplied. Yeah. I don't know about sucking the poison out. I don't I don't I didn't see that uh command. Alright. Alright, this is why we run healers. Oh shit! 
Mother effer, these scorpions hurt. <sighs> Keep yourself alive, Val. No! Bastard. This is ending up like a grinding gear boss fight. Jesus. Nineteen, okay. I think we can I think we win the race at this point. <laughs> so wait, does experience get equally di di divided up? Did, did Tuna get a ton of XP because everyone else is dead? Yes? Okay. Hot damn. Hot damn. All right, Tuna's just a god now. I'm fine for that. I'm fine with it. This is, this is, this is fine. This is, this is exactly how our uh, our dungeon fights go in Final Fantasy XIV so often, you know? End up being the, the last person standing. So uh, well, let's get our asses to a holy man. All right, would you like to... Everyone? I'd like to raise everyone? Oh my god. The gill. The gill. All right, this is where I would save scum because of the expense. But... I also kind of love, I can't, I'm not going to lie, I like Tuna being the highest level. It, it don't, everyone, it rests everyone at one health, so then you also, in terms of, you burn a bunch of gill, and then you also have to go pay for a, for a, re, for a rest. Oh, this is delightfully old school. I'm digging it. Na, na, na. Xavius, that is a very generous super. Thank you so much. So my donation for the Merlweb Lambo. Make it happen, folks. <laughs> On a serious note, thank you, Garrett and Kyle, for keeping me sane over the last few years of personal issues. Your bro-leveling hijinks get me from losing hope. Godspeed, you wonderful boys. Uh, means a lot to hear that, Xavius. Uh, happy to help, and, uh, and, and you know, grats on seeing it through the other side. You know, uh, I, I said it, uh, I think I brought this up on the Unwalker stream. Uh, it, go, it cuts both ways. Uh, the GG community has helped me through... Uh, some rough shit, particularly recently. Um, so, yeah, I, I appreciate it, and I'm happy to happy to help pay it back. All right, so we got blind. Uh, we got silence. Silence also seems like an important piece of kit. This is like all utility. All right, so I'm gonna wait on that. Maybe go pick up some black mage stuff. Anything to your liking. <clears throat> Deals ice damage to one enemy. Blinds all enemies with darkness. Raises one ally's attack. You know, blindness seems nice because of the all the poison we're running into. So, I'm going to get dark. I think I want... Blizzard and slow as well. Is temper that good? <sighs> Raising your MP. Oh, that's right. If getting blizzard because it does damage that. Temper on. Oh, that's right. Shit. Okay. And I mean, if we've got, we don't want to overcommit on modifying the enemies, right? Because we've already got dark and we've got sleep, so we could dark and sleep. Okay. All right. I like that. Oh, um, that's that's a suggestion I am down with. And then also Blizzard, because effectively gives us double the double the damage dealing spells. Uh, they do tell you that Blizzard's a higher level, right? Because if you look in here, it should say level two. Yeah, see, so it's level two. Yeah, so it does, it, the game, it, once you understand that you should be looking for that, it's, it's not super uh, obvious, but there is an indication at least. All right. It seems so specific, but you'd hate to be caught out without it if you go into a fight that is lightning heavy.
I would just go, I would pick up Silence and Null Shock would be my, my gut reaction. Because again, my RPG brain tells me this exists. So there's going to be a lightning damage heavy fight, if not multiple lightning damage heavy fights in the future. And then Silence is just like, that's RPG. That's just RPG goodness. That's a classic. You got to have Silence. Yeah. 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 Everyone's okay. What about Invis? See, I, yeah, see, I'm like, I'm like, but silence. But what if I don't want them to cast things? I definitely want Null Shock. This seems like it's going to be very important at some point. So I'm going to grab that. Yeah, definitely looks like he's flipping the bird. I'm with you. I am with you on that. Okay. Invis to keep Black Mage. Oh, shit, that's a good point. Okay, you sold me. You sold me on keeping my Black Mage alive. All right, we're going to go with that. Cool. You can forget. Oh, that's right. So it's not the absolute end of the world. I still like to uh, have a think. Dude, move. So rude. All right, what do I got? 153 guild. All right, we, we got to go back. We got to go back. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try this. I want to try this. Let's go to boosts. And let's try boosting gill. Let's give it just a, a gentleman's two time. Let's put encounters back on. Everyone's looking, everyone's looking handsome. Let's go. Let's go. All right, let's get a little more gill and get some gear before we, we ship off. Try sailing. Oh yeah, I'm wondering. Oh shit. Oh, there are random encounters. Oh, you get attacked by pirates. Hell yeah. All right, cool. Magic. We'll just have your attack for right now. Let's go. Okay, so the Buccaneers aren't too tough. Two seventy nine. Holy shit! That combo. All right. I should know y'all didn't wouldn't lead me astray. Ex unless it's funny, you would lead me astray. We found it. The origins of the sharks. Oh, it's a Sahagan? I know that word. Uh, magic. I feel like lightning? Thunder? Would be good on like a fish? Magic. Let's go ahead and protect our black mage because I don't know how tough these guys are. 72, that's higher than normal. Protect. Okay, so they're not... They're not nutsoid in terms of their health. Three hits. Down goes the shark. Jawsome. Okay, I would like to save. Right, we appear to be landlocked? Looking at the minimap? Let's see. This is where we started. Jawsome gets a like, hell yeah. Let's go here. Let's also go there. Let's... We got a bunch of them, so let's go ahead and raise our attack there. Let's maybe consider... Do that. Yeah, see, they're targeting the damn black mage. You miss! A shield. Nice.
Oh, he's actually invisible. Oh, that's adorable. On the go. So, what I'm finding difficult to keep track of quickly is MP. So, is each slash a magic level? So, I've got three out of five, two out of four, three out of three, and two out of two, but I only have level one and level two spells. Each slash is a level. Okay. Okay. Interesting. Just for hell of it. Let's see. Where is it? Half. Okay. I was curious if we could do like three quarters. But it's probably... Probably too much. Actually, let's just go ahead and head back to town real fast because... I think we have enough gill for the other things I wanted to pick up. And everyone got... Alright, let's see. Iron armor. Yep, let's go. Iron armor. Cool. So now we can sell the chain mail. Oh, crap. I wanted to just double check leather armor. Already got that chain mail as a downgrade. Iron armor. Okay, everyone's good with the armor from here. And then we can take a quick peek at weapons. How are we doing on items, by the way? I did burn. Yeah, we need more antidotes. Shit. Poison, man. Poison. Yeah, let's, uh... Double up. Alright. Weapon store. You are always in the way. There it is. Welcome. Alright, so we got the broadsword. And then okay, so everything else is just for just for tuna. Okay, so we got everything we need. So for our purposes, I'm gonna go ahead. And turn off the gill boost now. And just kind of see if we level out again. I will find equilibrium. Getting texts from Kyle, but they're personal. <laughs> All right, let's see. go ahead and save. Probably should have healed, but. I will live with my errors. All right, let's see here. So what's down here? Is there anything stopping me from just stepping on the land? Up here? Okay, I think you probably need one of those dock-looking things. Okay, can't go in there. Oh, shit. I forgot to turn the counters back on. Nope, you cannot just walk on land. Oh, that's a lot of fishmen. That's a lot of fishmen. Oh, you know what's interesting is it doesn't tell you what level the spells are. You kind of just got to remember what is two and what is one. Interesting. And this is why you always heal when you're in town.
69. Nice. It's a nice amount of damage. It's a nice amount of damage. Okay, shit. Uh, let's see, can we heal with like spells out of... Yes, it would appear we can. I played Sea of Stars recently. This is how I roll there and this is how I'm gonna roll here. I wish quick save was earlier up and only took one button press. Uh, oh right, you can go through force. Jeez. Stupid fast attack attacking wargs. Down you go. Welcome to level 10, JC. It's just tell me we got an antidote off of them? Oh yeah, look at that. I have, if, if we've been getting items off of things, I have not noticed. Oh, the other one. Yeah, I think we can take a few more steps. Oh, the blue dot is mine. Hello, kingdom. Elfheim. In case anyone tries to kill me. What's up, Link? I love Zelda. Big fan. I just don't know what we can do. Please help our prince. Okay, yeah, but but what if I bought your weapons first? What if I bought your weapons first? Uh, is dagger better for? I thought it came. No, you have a knife, not a dagger. Yeah, sure. Why not? Gives the black mage more shanking power? Hell yeah. Oh, nice. We can sleep. We need to sleep. Don't forget to sleep, everybody. 100 gil per night! What? <laughs> Why is it so expensive? Oh my god. All right, all right, all right. We'll pay it. Inflation. <laughs> all the internet points to Misha. Freaking hitting us with the elflation. My god. Kyle, thanks for the eight months. Updated ballad music baseline sounds like Perry the Platypus theme. I I am unfamiliar, but uh, but happy to have been informed. <laughs> hey, it's uh, it's Zelda. It's good to see you, Zelda. How you doing? I am a sage. When the time is right, the future is revealed to me. Shall wait patiently until then. Okay. What armor you got? What you got, elves? All right, we already got the kids. Ooh, copper armlet. Ooh, eight. Hundred gil, Jesus Christ! Uh, I mean that's an upgrade. Um, oh, leather caps for everybody, nice. A helm, oh, okay. Well, we can afford this stuff. Yep. Uh, let's get two of these. We'll take two of those. I'll take one of those. And then we're going to optimal, and then we're going to optimal, and then we're going to optimal. Nice. And then we're gonna sell all the crap. Leather shield. Bye. See ya. Didn't use it for very long. Okay. Future. Yep. Yep. Hit him with the future. Hit him with the. You gotta hit him with the future. You gotta do it. Now right, let's see here. Are you a church? Or are you just a big church? You're a big church that's smaller on the inside. You are like the opposite of a TARDIS. <laughs> yeah, well, thanks for this Gemma Super. Uh, uh, we appreciate your donation of Gil. For the, I mean, Elflation is real. 
Let me think you're liking. Okay, we got level three spells. They are a thousand gil a piece. Jesus. Yeah, I think I think two times gil XP at normal rate of speed is is probably gonna give us our our balanced, not horribly over leveled experience. Dear God, lowers the evasion of all enemies. Like, oh, we got an AOE. Paralyzes one enemy. Deals fire damage to all enemies. We got two AOEs. Lowering evasion. All, all this. This like we could we could just stack three AOEs, including Fokara. Fokara, for Kara, for our mods. That's what that's for. That's what that is for. Cannot cross the stream on foot. It looks so deep, to be fair. How do we get across there? How do I get over to that bridge? Oh, here's a bridge. It's a gravestone. It's a gravestone. What the shit? <laughs> I did not know. I did not know this was in here. Oh, what a great... Was this in the NES version? Was this... Was this in the NES version? One of the few Easter eggs. Hot damn. Hot damn. That's a great, that's a great Easter egg. All right, and then what are we getting? What What can we not afford yet? So it's HP to one ally. I'm assuming it does significantly higher healing. Damage to all undead. Okay. This is fire damage by half. Oh, AOE heal. Oh, shit. I want that. Oh, shit. Oh, that's shock. Oh, my name is Garrett, and I love AoE heals. I love them. Big fan. Hey, Link, what's up? No one knows where Astus, King of the Dark Elves, is going. Okay. Well. Square's saying, take that, Nintendo. But this was on their... Wait, what just happened? Oh, shit. I was going to say, but this was on their console. This was on a Nintendo. This was on Nintendo. Okay, all right, okay. We go around, we go around. We don't want to go that way because that will exit us. Wait. Is this... Do they have different spells or is this just for your convenience? Oh. Wait. Shit. Level 3 and level 4 is here. Okay. So this is like grind central. Okay. Cure poison. <sighs> want that. Reduces ice damage by half for the entire party. Here's silence. Okay. All right. These seem like good pieces of kit. Elves want all your money? Yeah, apparently. You also a sage? Okay, you have the exact same dialogue as the other sage. Single target sleep. That seems very good. Oh, that seems great. Ice damage to all out. Shit. Shit. I, uh, I probably would just skip the single tar target sleep. Right now, I'm going to skip them all, though, because I ain't got no damn money. I ain't got no stinking money. All right. Let's see here. Any new items? Didn't potions used to be 30? The things just go up for convenience. Or were they always 40? Because I know Phoenix Down was 500. Ten sleeping bag. They were 40? Okay. Gold needle. Cure stone. Okay, so nothing crazy. I sold everything I want to sell. Yes, yes, okay. Did I check this? I did check this. Okay, so it's a big loop. So something's wrong with it. Was there like an actual castle here? This takes me back to the map. Oh, what if I walk straight into the castle? Because that's how the other town was. Ah, ha, 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 ha. I am the world's smartest gamer. They say... 
If you're quiet, you can hear Garrett think. Uh, the dwarves lie in a cave on the western edge of the... Oh, we have we have dwarves here. Do they say Lolly Ho? Yes, but Square was an indie dev at the time, not owned by or, or funded by Nintendo. Well, that's fair. That's fair. I wasn't I wasn't suggesting they were. Uh, oh shit. Okay, this seems like a story place. Oh, look at the little fireplace sprite. That's adorable. You can always hear the gears grind. You're damn right, crit. You're damn right. You're damn right. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna try talking to the sleeping person first. Oh, oh, okay. Prince is sleeping. The prince has slept under Astros' curse for five years now. Shit, man. Can I get that curse? That sounds wonderful. There must be a concoction that can rouse one who sleeps so. But where? Interesting. So no hints as to... Anyone got a hint? Stole into the castle and placed a curse. S is Curry with okay, but well, where are they? You gonna give me a hint as like what direction to trek? Talking about dwarves, but that just that seems like a non sequitur. That that dude just love this elf just fucking loves dwarves. Okay, we're talking about Matoya. Maybe Matoya brews a thing to wake up the prince. Oh, come on, for the love of God. I'm tr not trying to leave the castle. I would like a, like a pop-up message. That says, uh, are you sure you want to leave the castle? That's what I would like. I want to see if anyone... Okay, what's over here? You, you got a hint, right? Yes? See, I'm afraid every direction I take is going to, like, boot me out of the castle. Can I skirt the outside walls? Is this... Okay, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Don't take too many steps. All right, you. This room has been secured with the Mystic Key. Wait, where is this Mystic... Is, it, is there one Mystic Key? Breadcrumbs? Okay. All right, so I think we need... To, I'm assuming we need to find... What toy is... Crystal Eye. Oh, Jesus. This is gonna suck. This is gonna be pain. Attack my mages! Alright. That too. Nice. Okay, so we can focus the one. Here's temper was maybe unnecessary. Three hits, nice. Yeah, that, that invisible effect is very cute on the sprites, particularly on the uh, the black mage because of the dark, the dark uh, shadow face. They, they keep the, the shadow there even when invisible. It's quite cute. Um, okay. For posterity. Okay, let's see. We probably want to find a location of interest out here and hope to God there's a crystal eye in it, is where my head's at. Let's go in auto battle. These are just wargs. We fought plenty of wargs. Tried to flee. Stop hitting my monk. It's rude. God, the monk is such a powerhouse. All right. 
magic. Use cure. Bing, bang, boom. All right, let's see. How's our go? It is not the best accruing in the world. I think I am gonna. I think I'm gonna. This just feels right. I'm trying to find an equilibrium of not grinding so much that I'm over leveled. So I'm gonna. I'm gonna do that because it felt good. But we're also exploring, so we're just gonna. We're just gonna rock it. Rock it and see what happens, but I think that's my current feeling on if you want a relatively smooth trajectory without just dumping on the XP, we can just attack auto battle this. Oh, you fled, you cheeky bastard. Four white mages, it'll never work. <laughs> uh, let's see here. Let's keep our black mage topped off. Anything interesting down here at the bottom? There's a hole. Why is there a hole? I should have saved before stepping into the hole. Oh, you can just leave it. Okay. Thank Gorn. Let's do a hard save. Is the, is the bat a thing? Ooh, spooky zombies. <laughs> Thank you for the super. You are, I think you have a point there. I think you have a point. You you have a bright future in marketing. You know your your messaging is solid. Actually, I do not want to auto battle because I don't want to double cast in biz. Ooh, damn. Zombies got hands. Shit. Probably should have opened with that. Probably should have opened with Daya. Uh, yeah, shit. I don't have a Phoenix down on me. All right, y'all. We're going to do it. Our first ever save scum. Because I forgot about Daya. <laughs> it's a Daya situation. Wow, it, it we had a random encounter in the exact same spot, but not the same random encounter. Not the same. Monk open with Daya. Yeah, aha. Uh -huh. Gray ooze. Why gray ooze? Or like, what? What would gray ooze be susceptible to? I'm just gonna see how many hit points these things have. Okay, a decent amount, but not an absurd amount. Just gonna let the hits fall. Cool. Key key. Oh, the bat just you just talked to the bat. Adorable. Right, how do I turn walk on? Because in a place with random encounters, running is kind of spooky. I want my steps to be very deliberate. All right. Here comes the pain. Open with an attack because Gaia might just 
kill all the things. Here we go. Dia. Hell yeah, white mage for the win. That is much better. I was about to say, this looks like a place that would have a door. A ladder? Right. So that's just three entrances. Let's see what's over here. Okay, skeletons aren't bad. Blood bones is kind of scary. Let's open up on the crawler because I don't know what's going on with that. Oh, is my what's going on? Oh, there we go. Let's see. Attack, attack, and then I don't see any reason not to rip another Dia. Wait, is the crawler also undead? No, it's a miss. Okay. Okay. All right, the Blood Bones doesn't hit Tuna for shit. Doesn't have a ton of health. Okay, all right. Didn't need to be as scared about that one. Maybe we rip an Ether. On Val. Wait, ha has Val been using... Sorry, I want to see the st status of magic. I haven't used a level three, but I don't have a level three. Okay, so ether we will get. Okay, let's go ahead and rip an ether on Val. Right, how's health on everybody? 65, 76, 83. Uh, we can. Let's rip up ocean on our monk. Okay. Can you use resonant undead? Would it just kill them? That would be adorable. See a door? I want to go towards the door. There's a chest! Oh, shit. I hate scorpions. I don't like scorpions. Not a scorpion fan. Oh, shit. All right. Go ahead and blind them. Let's do that. No! You bastard shit. Oh wait, didn't poison the white mage. Okay. Not so bad. No need to be elegant. I think the monk will get us there. Okay, cool. Hold on. Okay. All right. Leveling up. can't sleep in here, so just potions. Should have bought more potions. Hey! Hooray! Shit, level up. Is that all? Oh, yeah, just 2 HP. Yeah. What you gonna do? Them's the breaks. You wanna enjoy a retro game? That's what's gonna happen. Green slime with preemptive strike. Okay, let's just brute force this and see what happens. Nice. One, did one damage. Hey, all right. Oh my God, I bought a broadsword. I guess I can sell it and get money. That's all. We've been getting a decent amount of use out of the broadsword. 
crystals, stolen eyes, starting from a castle town. Matoya is here. Welcome to Heaven's Word. Oh, thank you, John Deere. And Lyra, thanks for another super. Said, I'd put you or Kyle ahead of me for a marketing position any day. Or our beloved Madkara. <laughs> marketing mods. Thanks for the super. Back in our day, casters got HP when they leveled up, not intellect or spirit or any of this new age mumbo jumbo, and we were grateful for it. And there just appears to be a bunch of loot down here, and I am not mad about that. Oh, uh, okay. Borg wolf and werewolves. This is nothing special. Uh, health appears fine. We're just going to auto battle the, the deeps. Oh, wait. They have a chance of poison? I didn't, I guess, I mean, they are green. Probably should have, probably should have saw that coming. God, just gonna burn through antidotes. That's why we bought them. If you buy items, use the items. I wanna save those last two spell slots on the white mage for uh, Dia in case we run into any more of those groups of uh, Multiple undead. Hey, another potion. Okay. I'm getting potions, but I'm needing to use more potions because we're down here. Ah, oh, fucking scorpions, man. Would, would flea work? Did we just get a bunch of rolls on flea? Okay, that worked. That worked. That worked. Hey, John, what's up? Uh, okay, we got another door over here. Does this connect? This connects. Nothing else in this room. All right, so we actually want to... Is it the... I actually do want to answer this. Is, is, is it the green werewolves that have a chance of poison? Because they're green? Other than that, if there's any old lore about werewolves giving poison, I am unaware of. Yes? Okay. All right, so we want to focus the werewolves first. That's fine. I love how little damage they do to frickin' the warrior. Okay, poison enemies down. Sweet. Oh, but we... Is there a chance of getting poisoned on hit? Like, you land a hit and you get poisoned? No? Oh! Okay. I didn't think the werewolves landed hit. There's a chance on Borgs to also poison? Oh, that's annoying. Man, we are, uh... It's the antidote run, y'all. It's the antidote run. <laughs> I can see why that would happen, dude, Runner. Also have a staircase going down. So we're going down, down in an earlier round. Okay. Oops. We'll fall out, boy. So far, I haven't had a reason to. Oh, why are we doing so little damage? They are also doing little damage. Why is the damage so low? Are they flammable? Don't really have any, they're not undead, so the, the white mage can't do anything special. Let's see. Uh, nope. 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 Okay. So, for, at least for my party comp, slimes are operation, uh, use up all of your black mage's MP. Oh, and they have a chance for poison, you bastards. Okay, we're... Oh, no. Okay, there we go. There we go.
Okay. All right. Um, I actually don't know, John. Thank you for the super. I don't know if Kyle has announced the baby name. Um, I know it, but I don't know if he has announced it, and so I will not say it here. Uh, and two, Joko Cruise 2020. What is Joko Cruise? Is Joe Cat doing a cruise? Is that what's going on? Is that what's happening? Jonathan Colton? I don't, I don't know. I'm unfamiliar. I don't know who that is. Uh, and then Gibgano, thank you, said, just wanted to say the stream helped me bust out some kills on Emerald Weapon for that robot dragon mount. Thanks for holding down the fort. And thanks for recommending Control. Oh, yeah. Enjoy Control. That game is awesome. The Portal Song Guy. Oh, I didn't know. Okay. Who's poisoned now? <laughs> My Black Mage. I think we can take a few more steps. So we got another room full of doors. Oh, that's evil. Okay, we are. I'm deploying Operation Flea when I see poison. You bastards. Is all our fleas? Wow, we are failing all the flea checks. That is max level unfortunate. I would like to finish exploring at least this level before, oh my God, this place is, before heading back. Okay, this we can deal with. we can deal with. Right, what's wrong with Tuna? Tuna ain't looking so... Is Tuna, like, uh, paralyzed? Is that what paralysis looks like? That's what paralysis looks like? Okay. Does paralysis persist? Or am I good? Holy crap! Okay. Tuna's going Super Saiyan 2. You're good. Okay. Thank you. Thank you for the clarification. I haven't seen a gargoyle yet. I feel like I should be afraid. Stay undead is my next question. This would be my last dia. Let's 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 see if I should fear them first. Okay, they've got hell. Aw, oh, temper didn't land before the first monk hit. Shame. Shame that. Okay. They've got health, but not so much that I'm worried. Okay, this this should Clear him out. Yeah, 227. That's looking all right. Are we just naming all JCs at this point? Is this now a JC stream? This is the most JC heavy stream involving no one named JC. Ugh. Ugh. You wound me, game. Oh, my. Oh, no! Run. For the love of God, run. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. All right, we're gonna, we're going old school RPG mode. That's what we're gonna do. I ain't gonna turn engagements off, but we're gonna, actually I should probably potion my black mage. That was also quite low. That'll be my last potion. Okay, let's, let's see if we, oh, 
Here we go, baby. I'm gonna get out. No. You got. The, you, you got. The, you got. You got the poison in you. No. Don't land hits. You fuckers. A pox upon you and your family. Who got poison? I didn't even see that happen. Last antidote. Oh my god. Okay. Wow, this room is huge. Mr. Keed. We got Mr. Keed, y'all. We got Mr. Keed. Oh boy. Where did you come from? Where did you go? Where did you come from? Cotton Eye Joe. All right, we are in operation. Open the rest of these doors and get the F out. That's... We could fight some gargoyles. because we don't want to double cast temper. Hey, it hit before the first monk strike. Hell yeah. Oh no, we lost Val. Shit. That's bad. Oh no. Nope, we want to potion yourself. Should do it. Yep. All right. All right. Let's see. Mark's cave claims another. Yeah, this place uh, is in fact a hellhole. Although that is a hellhole full of a lot of gill. And I'm just not sure we're gonna live to it. Get out of here. We could just like spam flee. Okay. <laughs> just valve. Dead ass there. <laughs> I should have saw that coming. Those look like mind flayers. Can't escape. Oh no. Oh no. Out of tempers. 77 jet. Oh my god. The humanity. Oh, this is bad. Yeah, we we dead. We dead, y'all. It's going to be all she wrote. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah, well uh okay. So Oh my god, that's right. Crap, my save was a little far back. What was in here? This was like one of the big deal ones. Nope, that was just potion. That's fine. That's fine. We are we're in flea mode. That's what we're doing. All we're doing is fleeing. All fleas all the time. Nazul said, fun fact, Square got in trouble in either the NES or GBA release for calling them Mind Flayers. Oh shit, I didn't know that. That's right. We don't want to go down there. That's a trap. We can't open that door. We do want to open this chest because it's a bunch of gill. We know it's in here now. Oh, but this is just... This is Jack's XP and gill because we got this. And the power of Christ compels you. And also my monk's fists. Down you go. <laughs> Tuny. Yeah, right? Exactly. Oh, crap. I made some steps. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, quick save. Because we're going to scum our way out of here and buy a lot more. An we're going to spend all our gill on antidotes. How are we doing on gill, by the way? Holy crap. Okay. I think I can turn off the boost. I think we can do that now. Maybe. Where is that? No, it's not PC boost. It's literally under boost gear. There we go. Alright. Let's do that. And then let's also quick save, so we don't need to do that again. Cool. 
This is the trap room, I believe. You're a trap. <sighs> Why'd I go one step further? Nope. This is a room full of nope. I'm just gonna land hits. Miss, okay, we like the miss. I like the miss. There we go. Alright. What's down here? I see. I see a door. This probably progresses us further into the dungeon. Nope. Okay. All right. Operation, get the hell out. Where's my escape rope? I need escape rope, everybody. Oh, I, I, I don't doubt that there's an item in that chest. I doubt my ability to clear it in my current state. No. No. Val down. Val's down, everybody. Wait, was this how I got in? No. Wait, hold on. Did I not open this? Oh, copper omelet. The copper armlet is a... That's, that's what you wear on your body? Hold on. Oh, yeah. Interesting. So, um, yeah. Black mage just running around in nothing but an armlet? Okay. All right. I guess that makes sense. Sure. I'm just going to quick save. F it. I know Val's dead, but we're in uh, Operation Save Scum, a bunch of flea rolls. Man. Ooh, piece of candy. How did we get down here? It wasn't over here, right? No, it was like in a room. In a room. Oh, there it is. It is marked. Okay. Christ. At least the uh, scorpions are rolling low on the initiative. Oh, God. How do I get out of here? The hat is for covering the junk? Okay. Oh, my memory is crap. How do I get... How did I get in here in the first place? Val's gone. Might have, we just want to... Jeez. Yeah, I was going to say, we just want to get out. Marsh Cave? Is, is, is this a known... I think it was in here? Shite. Okay, wait. No, I have, have I been in here? For the sake of stream, B1. Okay, yeah. I'm going to go ahead and turn off encounters. We're just... We're GTFOing. Unless you... Actually, let's see. We're going we're gonna to put the two of up. What's more fun? Fun to watch. The pain of chain fleeing... Or get back to town ASAP. Those are your options. The vote has commenced. The vote has commenced, everybody. We are voting. Smella Enchanted, if you're currently in chat, thank you for becoming a patron. Oh, you added your, your pledge. I see what happened there. Okay. Well, thank you for supporting us nonetheless. Much appreciated. Why do I have a bunch of Twitter mentions? Oh, because of my tweet. <laughs> All right. Get back to down there. Wow, this is actually pretty close. This is pretty close. A lot of you are uh, into the pain. We've got uh, some big pain fans here. So, th Okay, real quick. There is not a dock down here. Okay, so there's not like some shortcut by boat. And calling it a shortcut is kind of... It's questionably a shortcut because you can also get into random encounters in the water. So. 
A lot of sadists. I don't think there's anything wrong with uh, having a love for the way things used to be. He's tense a lot at the entrance. That's that's a that's an interesting way to play it. Oh no, this is a castle. I want to go to town. There we go. All right. So now we want to run. Okay, we want to. Where's the church? Here's the here's the reverse Tardis church. It's smaller on the inside. Two hundred. Oh, Jesus Christ. You ruined it, our beautiful world. I'm so sorry, everybody. I'm so sorry. All right. All right, then we want to rest. All right. And then... It's kind of twofold. I think we definitely want to find that... An that white mage spell that lets you cure poison seems kind of important. Oh god, is it a level 4? It's a level 4. My god. My god. This Dia seems to be doing work. I don't think we need the level 3 dungeon AoE. Right. I mean, we could buy it. That does seem the most important right now to me. Given the experience I just had, this seems really important to have. We're going to do that. How many four spell slots do you have, though? I mean, three, and I can only buy four, and right now I only have the one, so it's fine. That's basically the cure poison slot right now. All right, antidote. <laughs> How many? That sound. Can we hold on? That's a great noise. That is a great noise. How many casts do I have? That is... Now I... Now I have fear. Now I have fear. Let's see. Three. Oh, three of them. I mean, it's it's three more than I would have had otherwise. How much is it to completely cap this out? 49. I technically could cap out on antidotes. But it seems unnecessary. Maybe three. 30? Like. Because, mm. like, I could ether because I also can now cure poison, but ether is 150. And if I think about that as a way to just get rid of more poison, antidote is more efficient. So, yes, I did buy Poisana, but then you need Ether to... So it's like, I'm, I'm kind of splitting the difference here. So I'm going to go with, like, a Gentleman's 25. I think I'm going to do 25, but first I'm going to save. In case I hate the decision that I'm making. You cannot save in town? Really? Interesting. Oh, we're going to quick save. And we're going to do 25. You say 50? Say 50? It's 50. Let's uh let's meet in the middle. And say let's let's go with 30. We'll go with 30. Potions. Could probably use a few more. High potions. So it's 150 for 150, or it's 50 for 40. So I could just buy more potions. I could just buy more potions. Hmm. Maybe 
a few more tents because I do want to try the old school tactic of backtracking to the entrance and then using a tent if things get bad. So, okay. Let's go with that. Problem is now I don't remember any of the shit that was also for sale. I feel like... Twenty-five is minimum. Fifty is ever prepared. Okay, it's interesting to know. Well, I should probably buy a couple spells because I don't think we have any. I didn't buy any of these, right? I don't think my black mage has any level three. Okay, fire damage to all enemies, lightning damage to all enemies. Um, hmm. is f uh, I I think I do want an answer to this because. I was a guide RPG player back in the day. Is is fire or or lightning uh, super effective against any of the enemies in that damn cave? I, think I do want the answer to that. I know they're a thing. Fire undead, thunder for water. Okay, so we're going fire for the undead then. Analyzes one enemy. Okay. Well, we we need to spread it out. Is there a level three white mage spell that I wanted? Because I don't believe we have a level three. No, we do not. Alright, then we have Kira, Dayara. We already have Dia, and Dia seem to be doing fine, so I think we can get through with that. Ooh, I think I want the AoE heal. I think I want the AoE heal. Kira is just a bigger heal, right? I don't hate the idea of just being like full on healer. All right, let's go. We'll do that. Okay. Just out of curiosity, what are the other? We got the poison thing. What were the other white mage things here? Fear. Ice damage, silence, okay. Don't think we need those any, t well, anytime soon. I have no idea, but at least I don't think we need them in the cave that we're trying to clear right now. And you are single target sleep. Haste seems very good. Okay, I think haste is the next thing I want to grind for. But okay. Let's get back to the cave and then, shit. <laughs> And then we'll uh, we'll stop turning encounters off. Let's just go with that. We don't have any Phoenix Downs. Yeah, let's spend the last 500 on Phoenix Down. I like that. I like that idea. That's the castle. I do not want to go to the castle. I want to go spend my last 500 on a Phoenix Down. That's what I want to do. Uh, nope. I want the place with the tea the tea kettle it's real RPG spending half the time shopping yeah there we go emergencies yes the psycho demons very much look like mind flayers and apparently son of a bitch <laughs> Leaving town is my big is my hardest enemy yet. Cuz this is blocked, right? This is not a shortcut over to the hole or or wait, is it? Is this a shortcut? No oh, shit. Maybe. Okay, you can kind of get there this way. Thank you, Lyrith, for the super. 
Bob's a betting man. Chat seems to be the type of player that grinds near town, then skips battles on the way to progress the game. Uh, I mean, I could see that being... That's how I would probably do this. I like the idea of keeping it a little, a little spicy, though, and turning encounters back on in the dangerous area. Okay. Let's go. All right. We want to turn running off because we do not want to burn steps needlessly. We want. I'm going to explore north because we didn't explore north before. So you all have a chance of poison. I think the tarantula is worse, right? And we've already got our first poison of the cave. All right. I paid for it. I'm going to use it. Okay, this also goes down. Interesting. Okay, well, you're just a bunch of skellies. I don't see any reason to get fancy right now, because we're going to one-shot each and every one of you. Where were those encounters when I was trying to escape? So this goes down? And this... Weren't we in B2? Didn't we already go to B2? Nice, we rolled well on that one. This is a different B2, okay. I appreciate that clarification. Oh wait, there's a door, it's a door room, shit. Damn you! Evil beast. Damned evil beast. The urge to quick save often is real. Okay, this seems like a job for Dia. One damage. Yeah, that's all you got. Oh no, paralyzed. Sucks. More paralysis. All right, there we go. Are you afraid of poison yet, Garrett? I'm terrified of poison. Dagger? I just bought a dagger. Tried to flee, didn't work. Nice. 
There we go. <laughs> is is is, uh, is that how preaches Final Fantasy streams go down? Talking about spending money on gear. We're in it now. I'm terrified of this game. I am terrified. Nope. Nope. This is how I feel about slime. Slime can kiss my ass. Ooh, yeah, get that friggin' shit. He grinds for gear. And after my own heart. No! Yeah. I see slime, I run. AOE spell the green slimes? I guess I did, get, I did pick up that uh, that AOE fire, right? Oh, I thought there was a door there. Okay, wait, there's a door further down. I, I, don't, I, don't, I, I definitely don't oversave. I don't know what anyone is talking about. I know I can make it through these guys without. Getting nuts. Although the physical attacks from the, the mages are not doing much against these guys. Probably do for a bit of a heal after this. I have no doubt, Carrick. I have no doubt that I would have died on my first walk into here. Uh, hell, even not even in the original. If I hadn't been using some of the uh, like encounter off features and stuff, I probably would have died in this. Let's see. Use. We top off our monk. Everyone else is looking more or less good. Let's do that. Potion, nice. I'll take it. In real life, in frustration. <laughs> Just uh, get some free werewolf kills and possibly poisoned. No poison, yes! Thank the poison gods! Uh, that's a pretty decent level up. It's about decent level. I'll take it. I'll take it. Alright. So is there... There might be something to the right. Damn it. Did we just get the one poison? Nope, we got two. Is this just a dead end up here? Hmm. Let's give it a shot. We're going to try to get... Oh, interesting. Okay. You're scared. Oh, no, my black mage. Thanks to the Super Jorm. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I mean, uh, yeah. Like, my my old RPG of choice is, is Pokemon. So, uh, I feel that. Let's go with Kira on our Black Mage. Doesn't appear to be any way to progress. Get our zombies are, I think, goals are higher health. Mm. 
Will this just murder them all? Yes. Yes, it will. Level for a monk? Hell yeah. <laughs> Is that serious? Thanks, Beer. So the uh, Nintendo Power Strategy Guide said bring 99 potions before going to March Cave. Freaking feels like it. Okay, this appears to just be... I'm just trying to verify that this is indeed a dead end. That's what I'm trying to do. Right, I'm going to do this because I would have taken stronger notes. Yeah, this appears to just be a dead end. Okay. For the sake of not holding the stream here too long, this appears to all be... Okay. Can open is this a map? Oh my god. Holy shit. There's a map. Holy shit balls. I didn't know there was a map. <laughs> I learned something. Here, I feel like the encounters are perfectly fine, so. Wait, did I okay, here we go keep them on because it doesn't really matter. Oh, except they're slimes. Freaking slimes. Didn't know there was a map either. Okay, I'm not alone. All right. This is the other thing is I was going to say, looking at this, it looks like, because you can kind of tell where doors are. Yeah, see, they do draw a door. So the way I was progressing before, the first time we were in here, that's apparently the, the way to go. What is a shadow? Okay, all right. I gotta fight this. I gotta find out. Should I be afraid of these things? I'm assuming phys physical is probably not all that great, but this is for science. Hey, 21. That actually, that's not that bad. From a, coming from one of the mages, 31. Yeah, okay. So they're not that bad. Kyle as a DM just cackled. <laughs> Kyle would love this. Okay, so I'm going to. I'm going to do it while we're here. You know, we, we burnt all that time. Shit. I was going to say, I was going to exit and tent. While we're near the exit. Now, now I have a heading. We just got an, uh, an achievement for defeating 300 monsters. All right, items. All right, what's the difference? Tent is both, and sleeping bag is just health. So we're gonna use we're gonna use a tent. Need another stream of Kyle's playthrough with you as a guide. That could be fun. Actually, that could be that could be quite fun. that and back down we go oh I have no doubt that Dia works on shadows it's just I didn't want to uh, use the I didn't really want to use the spell slot because I know what awaits me in the lower levels And the shadows, they seem pretty, uh, pretty low key compared to the bull that exists down here. I have a strong need. I have, suddenly have a strong urge to save my spell slots for emergencies. How's everyone doing on health? Hale and hearty. All right, so zoom in, zoom out. Okay. 
Oh, nice. It shows me where I've opened chests already. I think we went in there and it was empty, right? I think that was a trap room. I do want to verify this. And I don't want to... Okay, yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. So, nope, I do want my map on. So we want to continue deeper, which is this way. We do not want to run, though. Because them's wasted steps with... with which with random encounters. Spooky. Ooh. That hurt it. Leave Al alone, you jerks. repels. <laughs> hey, WFL. Thanks for becoming a member. Welcome to the Gearbox. Appreciate it. Uh, let's go ahead and burn. That's also my Dia slot, so we're gonna potion. Maybe we just do it again. Wait till you're lower and you're at full health, so seems like a good place to quick save. Is Val wearing the correct armor? <laughs> I'll do an Iron Man run uh, with, with uh, a white mage named Val wearing no armor. Let's see here. So, oh, so it also will just tell you if you check those rooms. Have I not checked any? I thought I was here. Did I not check any of these rooms? My God. Nope. We're not fighting slime. We're not doing it. Slimes are bastards. Okay, so yeah, I guess we have not been here. It only shows when you're in the room. Uh oh, interesting. Oh, okay. Well for this. Oh no. Oh no. My post-it is gone. Okay. Uh, I need something to write on. Let's go on the back of this post-it. So, we've got, uh, let's see, it's, what, four? Four wide? we got a grid here. All right. One, two, three, four. That's... I'm just, I'm just drawing everybody. I'm drawing. I'm using third-party tools. Okay, and then how many rows is it? Oh my god! Oh my god! And I got more. We got more, and oh, and then we got more. So it's uh, it's four by four. Okay, interesting that it's interesting as a game mechanic. So. We can cross off the top row because I'm gonna loot this room, and I already so the two middles are empties, and we looted that. Uh, we can cross off that guy, but we want to go though that one. And these two can be crossed off because they're empty, and then we got looted, looted, boss room, looted. I'm gonna draw a little skull on the boss room. And then we want to loot all of these? That room looks like a trap because there's no chest. There's just gargoyle. Um, okay. I'm going to say we want to avoid that room, but we do want to go to that room, and that's also going to suck because that's gargoyles. So. I want to see what's in that room first before going to the boss room. But first, but first, first, let's grab that. Oh shit, a phoenix down! I know how expensive those are. I have a frame of reference for respecting the phoenix down now. Nope. Do the oozes? Do the oozes poison? I actually would like an answer on that. Do the oozes poison, or is it just the slimes? Because I think we fought some oozes already, and I don't remember getting poisoned. 
Does anyone remember? Don't think so? Okay. In that case. I think they were fine with physical attacks? Yes. Physical attacks were fine against the oozes. It's the slimes that are absolute bastards. Green things tend to poison. Okay. Good to know. Hey, hey, hey tuna leveled up. This is how scared I am of this friggin' cave. Alright, so we want to go all the way down. All the way down. Because I want to... Y'all know how this goes. No! You fuckers. I am playing FF1. I'm glad you think it's rad, Weisha. You know what's not rad? Poison. Poison isn't rad. Rooms full of scorpions aren't rad. The marsh cave in general. Bastard. Studious. All right, I know these have a chance of poison, but it's not nearly as bad as half the other things we've been fighting. We should probably do a little bit of grinding. Do I want to rip that on the things, or do I just want to... White damage them down. There's a poison. We're getting poisoned. No antidotes until the end of the encounter because more poisons could come out. We don't want reapplications. Oh, the mages are uh, not really helping. At least not on the green guys. I think they're fine on the blue. For white damage. I'm trying to save my spells for the crazy undead poles. Because we've got fire AoE and we got uh, damage. Uh, we've got Dia on the white mage. This should wrap it up. Do it. Watching this, I can't believe I played this game when I was like eight. It's, it's got depth. You know, it's a little, I could see this without, oh my, auto battling is a godsend. This, this would be an extreme grind. However, also knowing the, like what games were like, cause you know, I was, I had an NES. Um, I would have. If I was into RPGs at the time, I wasn't. But if I was, I would have loved this because it just would have been so much content. Let's check this room. Oh, for fuck's sake, that's right. Need a key. Need the mystic key. Drawing a key next to that room. This is, it doesn't tell me. Is it just boss time? Because gamer brain... All right, here's here's how my gamer brain is working. There's nowhere else to go in this room. I think we've explored all of the marsh gate. Gamer brain is telling me that the item I need is either in here or in this chest or, or something. There's a room with two chests. Oh, that's right. That is correct. Uh... No, wait, we did. We oh, oh shit, we missed that. Okay, let's let's go there first. I'll fight ya. Oh magic. Oh my god. Need like a single target damage spell on the white mage. Is what I'm I know Dia would attack them all, but I've only got three casts left and I know they just full clear the they make they make those uh, they make those um skeleton encounters so easy. They dork sided? Okay. I don't think I need to heal yet. Monk's fine. So we want to go up one. Yes. I missed this one. A quick save just in case some BS happens in here. 
Wouldn't put it across uh, past this game to be like, and a mimic attacks. Nope. I see news, I run. Oh, oh, the pause made me thought, think that uh, attacks were about to be assigned. Potion, okay. C cottage? I'm assuming it does not mean a, like, like a cabin in the woods. What the frick is cottage? Oh, you little, no, it is a cat. You erect a cabin. <laughs> you just build a cottage? Huh. Okay. Right, so we're going to quick save that. Close. It's empty. Okay. All right, so we can cross that one off. All right. Single use house. Okay, so I think it's Mind Flare time? Uh, I'll fight some moves, why not? Now we one shot, nice. 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 Single use house, not very sustainable. No, no, it is not. So is it time? Do we dare? Do we dare do this? Do we dare? This is a question we ask. Should probably top off my monk. All right. Party's looking pretty damn healthy. We got plenty of spells. Here we go. Monsters. Only four, thankfully, and not however many. There were, what, seven statues? I'm glad it wasn't seven of these. Okay, so you're just you're just going to attack. You're just going to attack. You're going to temper my monk for maximum damage. And you're... Are they undead? Because they're demons. Right? Not undead? They're not undead, are they? I don't think they're undead. I think we're going to invis the black mage for safety. These guys hit hard. 82. Oh, the double hit on the monk is bad. Miss. Oh, thank God. All right, now we're cooking with gas. Yes. Nice. You are my main attacker. You want... Let's try getting the blind off. And then you are our healer now, so you're gonna... Yeah, what's everyone's health at? We really were just worried about our... That's to the entire party. Our cure's poison. Okay, we want a pretty big heal on our monk. So we're going to see what this new heal is all about. Nice! I'm very happy with that order of events. Oh, I missed! <laughs> I don't know, Crit. I don't know where he went. Alright, um... Spread the damage out a little bit. How's health looking? Everyone's looking good. Can I get another buff out? I'm also, yeah, rip, let's rip it. Because the, the monk is getting targeted. Something fierce. Nice. We did it. Our first, like, pretty tough fight. The combat's fun. Like, Invis is really obtained the crown. What do I do with the crown? All right, I'm going to open the sketchbook. We're going to start. This is going to be my Final Fantasy One notebook. That's what this is going to be. That's what this is going to be. All right. I'm going to place the jot down. So, uh... Marsh Cave. It 
They obtained a crown. Seems important. I'm going to make notes. I'm going to make a note of that. Room for doodles? Plenty of room for doodles. Look at this thing. Plenty of room for doodles. All right, getting rid of the, the crappy... Oh, except I do want... Marsh Cave. Crap. Ugh. I should also transpose my my grid. Uh, we're going to call this the Marsh Cave... Cave... Grid Room. Because I don't remember the basement level. And that was... 4x4. Four four. Just transposing my notes, don't mind me. We can check that off. We can check off the boss room. And... All right, so we got three rooms at the bottom we got to check, except, well, shit, we know one of them's a key room. All right. My notes have been transposed. Definitely want to save. And we want to potion twice on our map. The world map gives you information on all the treasures. Interesting. All right, so it looks like we got at least two more fights to do if these rooms don't require a, a mystical key. Or mystic key, I think is all. I don't think it was mystical, mystic. I think it was mystic key. Oh, they're just oozes, thank God. Mapping extreme, <laughs> thanks for the super call. Well, shit. All right, so I think it's safe to assume every bottom room needs a mystical key. And instead of pulling up a guide or asking chat, I can verify very quickly. So let's go ahead and verify. Yes, okay. <sighs> what was in that room? Is this also a mystical key room? Yes. Green thing jump scare. So yeah, we're pretty much, so that's everything, right? Because we cleared every other one of these rooms and there's no, the, the only thing to do here is to leave. Did you check second door? Yeah, all, all three of these are a mystic key. So this should be second door. Yep. This is, no, this is second door. Yep, these are all Mystic Key Doors. Every single every single one of these is a Mystic Key Door. So, I have encounters turned off for sanity's sake of double-checking all this. So, what did I miss? Is there anything in here I missed? Bottom two is two doors. See, logic would make me assume... It's all a bunch of bunk, yes. Yeah, it's all, these are all Mystic Key Doors. All of these have been checked. Open chests, and then there's nothing in these rooms. The empty rooms are actually empty. The game is not, the game is not pulling a fast one. So like, for example, that's actually empty. So, That goes down. Okay, let's enter a room and then we can see what's in here. I believe we've checked everything in here and that's just an empty room. I'm gonna keep encounters off to verify. Cause this is the point where if I was playing by myself, I would pick up a guide and be like, all right, have I missed anything in the marsh cave? 
and I don't think I have. The game does troll sometimes. So we should check, because this is the entrance. Yes. Oh, you know what we didn't do? We didn't check the map in that other basement room. Nope, that's the exit. <laughs> I didn't check the map in here, because I, when I was in here, I didn't know the map existed. I think the game tried to tell me, but I didn't retain that information. I'd like to check on my own, and then I'll ask. I'd like to uh, sleuth it myself, and then... Okay. I have deduced that I am done with the Marsh Cave until I find the Mystic Key. I would like to point... Uh, I'd like to blatantly ask chat, is that the correct read on the situation? Correct. All right. Wonderful. Wonderful. That's my personal comfort level of I'd, I'd like to at least explore and take advantage of tools the game gives me, like turning encounters off, uh, to at least try and sleuth it for myself. And then I'm happy to ask for confirmation because this is older. And, um, you know, they're a little more... It's easy to miss things in these types of games. So people are saying the world map has information on items? Chests, 15 of 18. Well, that matches up with the chests that remain in the marsh cave that we can't get yet. Hmm. There's 13 chests in the Chaos Shrine? Jesus. So, what does the crown do? And where did it go? Oh, it's a key item. Okay. Don't know what to do with the loot. Don't know what to do with the crown. Um, let's see here. Potion on... A potion for my black mage. And maybe we'll also top off tuna. It do be shimmering, though. Yep. It do be shimmering. I would like to calmly explore. Okay, we've got a castle. And then we've got some islands that I cannot hop. At least not without the help of a boat. Okay, this seems important. Let's go ahead and uh, hard save. Let's turn encounters back on. Western Keep. Let's go ahead and turn off. Oh, cause this is, let's keep encounters on. I, this seems like a place that would have random encounters. Could be wrong. Well, now that I know the map is a thing. What? Who the frick are you? <laughs> you fools fell right into my trap. I am Astos, king of the dark elves. Is he gonna fight me? Would you like the crown I found? Instead of resorting to violence? With the combined power of the crown you now hold, and the crystal eye I already possess- Oh shit, he's got the crystal eye! Okay, so he's saying the power of the crown you now hold, and the crystal eye I already possess- Okay, so would he- If I had found him before going into the marsh cave, would he have been like, Fetch me a crown, dear adventurers! I am a well-meaning king in need of your help. Is that what I missed? Is that what I missed? You skipped an encounter? Okay. Hey, I'm, I'm just adventuring. You know, what? my adventure is my adventure. <laughs> I didn't skip with knowledge. I found the cave first, and that's where I went. That's where I went. Uh, I will become the true elf king. It is useless to resist me. I can take what is mine by sheer force. All right. Maybe I'll die because... Oh, man, that is a sprite and a half because I didn't, like, full rest before this. Let's try and make it work. Let's temper our monk. I have learned what to do. And let's invis our black mage. 
Oh no, he has haste. Haste seems really good, and I would like to get haste. Aw, oh, Temper didn't hit before the first monk attack. Rip! We did get to we did get to invis our black mage. Which feels good. Okay, alright, let's uh I don't know what the hell a goblin is. I don't think anything special. We could blizzard we could that's AoE. Uh let's just thunder, because it's pretty. Magic. Okay. Uh, 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 let's see. Um uh, we could potentially it cures darkness. Damage, raise an ally's defense. We can also invis. That's our last invis. That, well, honestly, we're probably... We're probably heading back to town after this. So, let's go ahead and rip an invis. Thunder! Thunderstruck! What is the thing I can do? On. Mostly healing. I've gone very heal focused on my white mage. Oh, it missed. Nice. What? <laughs> Did it hit? Did it hit my monk? And is my monk wearing sunglasses? Because that's the coolest shit ever. Is my monk wearing sunglasses? Because dark hit. Also, GG, y'all. We just beat the Dark Elf King. That's what blind looks like. It just puts sunshades on. That's fantastic. That is absolutely fantastic. You obtain the Crystal Eye. Hell yes! Hell yes! All right. All right. Shit, man. This is... This is an okay, I'm having a, I'm having an okay time. Oh, I see a chest in there. Okay. You yell Thunderstruck every time? Hell yeah, Lyrith. I'm always down for an ACDC reference. You've been Thunderstruck. Of course, the mystic key. How could I have known? Doesn't appear to be any other chests. All right, so. All right, so I'm assuming we want to return to Matoya. And this, what was this place called? So we've got a Western Keep. Okay, uh, I'm gonna start keeping a long list of. Let's see. Uh, we're gonna call this FF One Mystic. Key list because we keep coming across places that have that need the Mystic Key. So this was called Western Keep, yes, yes, Western Keep. Okay, so Western Keep is getting added to the list. Uh. We're going to say grid room in Marsh Cave. Okay, that's what I've got so far. Um, okay, so we want to quest back. We'll do it honorably. Because we confirm that North is a dead end. So we, we have kind of exhausted everything that we can do out here. I don't think we've seen Cobras yet. I would imagine Poisonous. But it's, you know, it's our first time seeing the Bastards. So, uh... No, we haven't tried Fire yet. We've, we've saved it. Let's, uh... Did we get poison? No. Y'all ever wish you could just turn off encounters at will in real life? I definitely have, Aloy. I have definitely wished that. Oh, man, have I 
wish that. I consider myself fairly social. But boy, sometimes... Ooh, I don't think we've seen an Ogre Chief yet. Sometimes I get over-socialized. I call it being over-socialized. And uh, when that happens, I just... Yeah. Fyra. Man, Fyra's a pretty effect. Yeah, sometimes you just, you just want to turn it off. You work in retail? Oh, God, yeah. Yeah, when I worked a... Uh, Jeez, I mean, when I worked as a waiter, when I worked at Target, yeah. Absolutely would have loved that. So I'm Ragamuffin. I think I missed your green thing jump scare message. Thanks for sending that earlier. I appreciate it. Your 23 mem months of membership. Good God. We really got to decide on a 24 month color. Because we're going to rest, so let's just let it rip. Let her rip. Fire. Black Mage things, man. Let's go. How's the encounter rate? Uh, it is exactly as classic as uh, exactly as classic as I expected it to be. Where did I drop my my boat? Oh, I guess it's north. All right. First things first. Let's get some rest. Hundred gil per night. Robbery. Robbery. The elf flation is ridiculous. Uh, thought so far, FF1 have hands? Yeah, I really like it. This is exactly what I was hoping it would be. It, it really, honestly, it's, it's, it's like exactly what I expected. Um, which is like cozy retro RPG vibes. I'm loving it. I also really, I, I was warned that it, it's not as like direct in your face with, with the narrative. And I'm really enjoying like what, how it's, it's more of a find your own adventure. Now, I don't want it to, like, lull too long, which is why I'm more than happy to, every once in a while, ask for some guidance from chat. Because I don't want to just be spinning my wheels. But I am enjoying that it's kind of, all right, go set off. You know, once you get the boat, the world kind of opens it up. And I like that it's, all right, you can piece this together. It's like, okay, I know I need a crystal eye. It's a little much for me to keep track of. I'm, I've started notes. Um, but that makes me happy. I like, I like making notes. Look at these notes. Look at the notes. So I'm, I'm rather enjoying it. So yeah, let's do a little upkeep. Um, we've got nine, almost 10,000 gil. So we've got Fyra. Paralyze one enemy. That seems decent. Lightning damage to all enemies. Lover's evasion. Well, Dan, these all seem good. Um, paralyzing a single enemy seems kind of, kind of nice. But oh, right, haste. I want haste. That's right. Thank you for reminding me about haste. Let's 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 start with the expensive spells and work our way down. Because it'll be with the the way the rate at which gill acquisition has improved, and I did I do believe it. The boost is still off, right? Yeah. Uh, it'll be easier to grind for the cheaper spells. So what's the Black Mage is haste. So we've got Cure Poison. I feel like I don't need that yet. I'm going to wait until the game punishes me for not being able to cure Silence. Excuse me. That was a truth or a yawn. And then I'm going to go by Silence. Or Cure for Silence. This seems like nuts. This seems very good. That also, like, Confuse also seems very good. Confuse seems kind of expe exceptional. Like, especially since I can, like, I, I, single target sleep seems good, but I can grab Paralyze, which is single target, on a, on a level three, which kind of seems like it would effectively do the same thing. Like, missing an attack is missing an attack. Confuse seems very good on paper.
Don't expect it. I wouldn't expect you to work on bosses, but like being able to like have if I had this in Marsh Cave, being able to turn all those uh, stupid scorpions on each other, that would have been great. So we got haste already. Haste, haste is done. Haste is purchased. Just I'm trying to decide on the others. I'm I'm really I'm personally curious. I'm confused. I think I can wait on the expensive white mage spells. So now I think we're back to the more affordable spells, which I need a loop for. Okay. And to your liking. So we got Kira, and we have Heal. Do I want any of these? A better DR does seem good. This also seems good. I just don't know if I need that yet. Again, I think I'm going to wait until the game kind of is like, hey, hey. The elemental nulls do seem good, but they haven't come up yet. And so we got fire, uh, and that's all we got. Paral that seems, I, I like the single target paralyzed seems solid. This also seems good because of just el how elemental works, like with water element enemies and whatnot. Seems like it's going to be good eventually. It also seems, see, this is, this is tough. I like all of these. Like lowering evasion of enemies also seems nice. Like, I, I'm pretty sure I want this. I feel like, I, I feel like I'm not going to regret getting elemental AOEs. So I'm going to get that. I don't know. I think I'm, I'm leaning towards, I'm leaning towards hold. I think I want to try that. I think I want to try that. So we can always, we can always grind some gill. We can always turn that boost on. How could damage possibly be bad? That's exact. That's how I live my life. All right. I think I will grab, just so I don't need to think about it when it does come up. I think I'll take that. I think I'm going to take the null blaze. Okay. All right. So, was there anything else? Were there any weapons? I'm trying to remember. I think armor was, I think we got everything we need with the the armor. We don't want to give a weapon store monk. That's a downgrade. Yeah, okay, so all that is meh. So we got an extra broadsword. 225, okay. Not about that. And I think that's it. Yeah, because we don't want to get rid of our phoenix down. We don't want to... We can't sell our house! You wouldn't sell a house. You need a copper. Oh, that's right. That's correct. That is correct. Yes. All the clothes, sell them. Dagger. Sell them. Is there anything else? That's it. Okay. Are we poor again? Um, I mean, relatively. You wouldn't download a car. All right. So I think we're we're basically in return to Matoya mode, right? Nope. Shit. We're in return to is it is it return to Matoya time? What seest thou, Master Matoya? Okay. Okay. Does it mark docks? Not. Really? 
I can kind of barely make out where docks are. Just barely. I think I see little gray things that denote docks. Okay. Well, folks, this might be slightly devious, but I do think that saying next time, and when I say next time, I mean tomorrow, on Garrett Tries to Beat Final Fantasy 1, returning to Matoya will be first on the docket. I feel like, I feel like that's good because now I like, I'm not in an ambiguous area where I don't know what's next, so I can't tell you what we're heading toward. So next time on Garrett Plays Final Fantasy, join us for returning to Matoya with her crystal eye. Um, I have thoroughly enjoyed this. Thank you so much for coming out. This. Uh, I don't really know what I expected, but I wasn't expecting to have this many people come by for this. So um, I will be live again tomorrow at the exact same time. So Tuesday, tomorrow, 1 p.m. Eastern, which is 12, 11, 10 a.m. Pacific. Join me right here. I'll be live. I'm going to go schedule the stream right now for part two of uh, my Final Fantasy I journey. And uh, if you're in the Discord, uh, let me know how my pace is. Will tomorrow be enough of a middle section that on Thursday I can bring it home? Or do you think I need to add a Wednesday stream in? Which I'm totally down for. So, anyway. Uh, GG for now. See you tomorrow, 1 p.m. right here. Bye, all.